Hey, I'm Grump. I'm not so Grump. And we're the Game Grumps. Welcome to Game Grumps. Uh, we're playing Link to the Past today. Link to the Past. Today. Link, Link to the very past. Today. Today. Okay, first of all, I want to know who's 410, who's 40, 4012? Um, well, this game isn't brand new out of the box, bro. I probably got it from a Goodwill or something. Did you so. have this from when you were a kid? Well, yeah, no, I sold it. Oh, that's right. You had like the Great Purge. Yeah, I had, had an amazing collection, and then I sold it all. That's but, a bad so, idea. So I don't know where I acquired this one. Seriously, it might have been from. Okay. But either way, I don't know. I really don't know what four forty twenty is. It's what four four forty twelve. So um, maybe it's the new Y two K. Have you ever? Room? <laughs> <laughs> have you ever noticed? Okay, there's a fucking cross of hair on this. It like blocks out the. It's like, oh, is that a, is that a, is that an O or an E? <laughs> Or is that a Y or a other one that looks the like a letter, Y? It, could, it looks like a like an uppercase R. Like the E looks like an uppercase R right now. Like, but tiny. <laughs> so it's oh like yeah. A, a, B, C, D, R. Yeah, it does. It Fight. Like a point. Well, okay, great. But I'm just saying, crosshair was a strange choice. You gotta look like, out. One for of them room. is like perforated. Help, Help me. me, please. So okay, little backstory on this. I like Ocarina of Time better. Why don't you keep hitting A while. Sorry. It? I like Ocarina of Time better. He likes Link to the Past better. And I don't honestly like this game that much, and I played it first, before Ocarina, when I was a kid. Yeah, well, it, yeah, it baffles me a little bit, you know, how much love there is for Ocarina, just in general, and and also from John Tron. And, it, and, it's, and it's weird, because, like, I'll hear him complain about stuff about that game sometimes. Ocarina? But it's still a masterpiece, yeah. Uh, when have I, what do you mean? Like, what's like it? every so often I'll bring up something like, oh, this is dumb, and you're like, Oh yeah, it was dumb. That was really retarded. But it's still a masterpiece. <laughs> well, it's like everything has flaws. You have a flaw. <laughs> and it's... <laughs> well, at least it's just one. <laughs> at least it's just one. No, no, like... Like, you were complaining earlier about the fucking eights on the stones. <laughs> I wasn't like... Oh. You were like, you were like, look, this is it. <laughs> Okay. This is it right here. This is why I'm done with this game. No, I, <laughs> yeah, go over to the right. Uh, no, why right? This is why I'm done with this game. Look at those eights. Okay, first of all, I never said I was done with the eights. <laughs> I just said, why the fuck's there eights? I don't know. Why the fuck's there eights? <laughs> why the fuck's there eights? <laughs> Coming soon. <laughs> uh, okay, but basically, fucking, I'm short on magic dick. I always thought this was like, foo foo. <laughs> oh yeah, look at that, it says foo foo. Have you ever noticed that? No, I did, I do now know, and I will forever. It's, it, I just always thought that was weird. But no, okay. Ocarina has a lot of flaws because it's the first of its kind. But it's a masterpiece in every way. Like, it's more about the feeling and the atmosphere in that game. And no, but the gameplay's good too. The Z-targeting -Z works like fantastic. And I think it's terrible. I think they did it really poorly. Mother of fuck. I, li li I, I think combat in Ocarina is really frustrating. There's all these moments where I'm like, I can't, oh, what's going, uh, 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 and then I get hit. But in this, it's like, it's really clear. It's like, you, your sword swings in a specific way. Well, that's because it's a top-down 2D game. Yeah, well, fucking in Mario, great. You can't be like in Mario 64, like, I can't just run to the right and jump. <laughs> I just can't. Yeah, well. <laughs> I mean, if they. <laughs> no, I understand Z-targeting, and they did it better in the later games. All I'm saying is that. It doesn't function very well in Ocarina. It functions in a way where there's a lot of problems and there's a lot of mistakes. And it's very clumsy sometimes. It, yeah, it can be. But that's kind of... But I think it still works surprisingly well. Like, No, there have definitely been times where I'm like, What the fuck? I can't not swing yeah, in exactly. the... But yeah, no, but I mean, like, it's a pioneer of a genre. Oh, this is the first of its time. It shouldn't be criticized ever. <laughs> I wish they could see the look I was doing. <laughs> <laughs> For anyone out there wondering what that silence was, that was <laughs> that was me giving Ego Raptor the look of death. Uh, you know, I'm, I'm really, I'm really, I'm really kind of upset because we were playing this earlier, and <laughs> you made a joke. What? You were, it was my favorite moment where you were like, you you tried to burn a dude with a lantern. Oh yeah. <laughs> and then, and we, you were like, we can pull that footage up. <laughs> we can pull it up and put it in here. Just we should, we should. All right, here it is. Uh, I seriously, I burned that guy, and he didn't even notice. It's like whatever. I'm just keep, <laughs> I'm just keep walking. What is that heat? <laughs> <laughs> what is there a reverse ghost here? <laughs> reverse? What does ghosts make you cold? Was there a red ghost? <laughs> <laughs> All right. 
Well, there, there you go. You saw it. There you go. We have to remember to do that. Don't just we just upload the video. And we're like, here it is. Laugh. Oh god. Okay. Where, where are you going? You, you can't fucking walk up the stick. You know what I'm saying? Good job. Thank you. I'm glad you made it. I'm glad you made a little song to go along with your, your dance. Okay. Well, let me see. <laughs> just, just get it. Okay. Like I get it. Like this. Here's the strength of this game. When you swing, you swing, you know, it's like really just a solid 2D. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And that's good, I like that. But you can't convert it to 3D that easily without it being weird. Why is that? Well, because it's a third person view. You can't just have him, like, you can't see behind him. You can't see in front of him as easily. You need, like, a new angle. <laughs> what was that? <laughs> and I use Z targeting. What, what, what are you talking about? Like, if you were. If it's a third person game. And he just swung. It would be really like, you wouldn't really be like, you'd be like, where am I swinging? So you need the Z-targeting, and the Z-targeting, yeah! I bit my tongue. <laughs> On that jump. I bit my tongue. That's perfect. That doesn't... You not fucking getting this? You wouldn't need Z-targeting, you would just need a button that centers the camera behind you. <laughs> like, seriously, that's what you would need. <laughs> Wait, sorry, what? You would just need a button that centers the camera behind you. You do have one, it's called Z. Yeah, but what I'm saying is, like, the Z-targeting isn't necessary. I think it is. It locks you onto, like, flying enemies. The, okay, okay, here's a better way to explain it. Everything on this, in this game is on one plane. I'm not saying Z-targeting's bad. Z-targeting is great. You they said it was bad! They executed it poorly. I executed and you. And they did it better in Twilight Princess, Wind Waker, yeah, and yeah, Skyward because Sword. They're newer games and they're better designed. Yeah, yeah. it's fun. Yeah, actually, yeah, in Twilight Princess, Z-targeting is fantastic. In Skyward it's Sword, like, it's, it's pretty good. If, too. It's like if there's something terrible that was in Legend of Zelda for the NES, I'd be like, that was fucking terrible. But I don't Link think. Link to the Past obviously did well, better. Like, okay. th that's the end of the story. Uh, yeah, okay. But you make it sound like. That's that makes but it what bad. But what I don't get is that like you can go back and you can say the NES Zelda is terrible, horrible. But <laughs> Ocarina is the greatest game ever. Yeah, because it has it, cinematic elements. It's a masterpiece. But the first game was a masterpiece because it was the first of its kind and it broke a lot of. It's boundaries. not because it's the first of its kind. You could turn, you could put great graphics on that game and it would still be a masterpiece to me. And they have 3DS version. The 3D, 3D yes version. <laughs> you really told it. <laughs> you really gave it an insult. Why did you do the loop? Why did you do that? I don't know which way to go. <laughs> I suck at the scum. What? I suck at the scum. <laughs> I suck at this game. I suck at this game. Hi, big boy. <laughs> big boy. Hey, big boy. Big boy. Hey, big boy. Big boy. I need someone who will speak a Chinese. Uh, you do better than me. Pick a Chinese. <laughs> uh, pick a Chinese. <laughs> <laughs> it's so funny to me. Oh man. So you just got a boomerang there. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Push, 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 push. I pushed the wrong. <laughs> I swung the sword. <laughs> get, get there before you boomerang. <laughs> it's gone. It's gone. One of the best strengths of this game is how time will freeze when you go up a stairs. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> Why is this the weirdest thing? <laughs> because it takes a second to go up the stairs, so... It's part of the experience. Mm-hmm. I spit... It's, well, just, just... it's just a thing. I don't know. It's just a thing. They decided right. that was a thing. Let's be... I almost said a bad word. <laughs> it, was, I just, it was just a thing. What do you mean you almost said a bad word? You can say bad words all you want! What <laughs> Not the this one! <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you, chain ball. <laughs> That's his name. <laughs> I, I learned it from the credits. <laughs> chain ball. I actually got the Ruby before she talked to me. Thank you, group. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, group, for stealing all my shit. I was Why? saving that so I could live in here. Why is there a five rupee in her dungeon? <laughs> I guess, I guess because oh, the, the prospect of saving the princess wasn't a reward enough, so it's like, oh, there's also a treasure chest in there. It's cool. <laughs> Dude, she's like, oh, I can't follow you. You're going in weird directions. <laughs> Stop! <laughs> Stop! Dude, Zelda is the best follow the leader player I in know. the fucking universe. I swear to God. Dude, she followed my leader. 
<laughs> Whoa! Were you about to give me the O face? I was giving you the O face. Ow, I hurt my jaw. What the fuck? Dude, he's all like, 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 what? He's all like, oh, oh, wait, hold on, he's all like, he's all like, oh. Like Zelda is taking. I'm not really sure anymore. He's like, oh. <laughs> He's like, I can't get it. I can't get it. Come on, get it. Oh, 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 oh no! <laughs> Fuck it. All right, uh, and that's gonna conclude this session of Game Grumps. <laughs> Tune in next time for the next part of Legend of Zelda. Oh, I paused. Legend of Zelda: Modern Warfare. Legend of Zelda: Modern Warfare. And welcome back. We're back to Link to the Past. Yeah, we're back. We're back. John we're Tron is playing a game that he hates, and I'm watching a game that I love. <laughs> uh, actually, okay, so yeah, the way we're doing this is pretty much for the most part, we're actually gonna do full walk- walkthroughs? Playthroughs of games. Well, I guess technically it is a walkthrough, because we were walking <laughs> through the game. Well, he's more like- it's like a brisk Congratulations. jog. Da, 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 go up, go up, go up! I don't know how to play this game! Just go up on the- you'll- Just go up? Just go up. Dude, you, we should- we should make it, like, like, really good quality, like, we have- like, you see sometimes on YouTube, like, Okay, you go to his place, and then there's a blue guy down there. You just jump, and you just hit him, and he falls <laughs> off. It's, it's kind of weird, it's kind of hard. But... <laughs> it's weird how he does that, and he turns into, like, a star. That's really weird. Is he, like, is he a star man, where he turns into a star when he hits the ground? Why is his sword sparkling? Biggest, does he have some kind of sparkle powers? Biggest strength in this game. Boom, you can hit people from behind. That's amazing. Fuck you. It's a spin attack. I mean, it's a spin attack. It was invented in this game and and, and, and done worse in Ocarina. Oh, <laughs> like a Zelda voice. Yeah, I know. Oh, 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 He's like, oh, we're doing this now. <laughs> we're doing this now. Look at the sunlight. The sunlight having a wonderful time. Okay. She, she would be a really great hoedown partner, I think. How dare you say that about the fucking princess? <laughs> <laughs> wow! <laughs> I've done it. You've already done it. I've done it. Gaddy. I'm in. I'm in. I'm in the club. All right, you gotta take her to the throne room, man. Dude. I'll take her all the way to the throne room. Okay, one thing I don't like about this game- I mean, she tells you to go to the throne room. I didn't even have to tell you, it just happened. Did she tell me? Zelda was like, you gotta take me to the throne room. Zelda's security. <laughs> That's where I gotta go. <laughs> Ow! Loud at mother! Okay. Another, another <laughs> thing Zelda's like, all right, let's keep going. <laughs> Another thing I don't like about this game is Link's hair is pink. What the fuck's that about? Fuck you. Why is it pink? I love how you came in this room first. Like what? Like as if she would be kidnapped in her own. Throne oh room. yeah, at the first <laughs> like, playthrough. Like, like here I am. It was the first playthrough I did that. Let's show that clip oh, right now. Show it. We're gonna forget. Uh, We're not really showing it. Me. I'm not gonna show that. Clip. Is that a fish? That's a rat. Okay. I thought I thought we were in water. <laughs> Okay. Do you remember that part in Legend of Zelda where they were like, Link can swim underwater, and breathe, <laughs> and walk, like normal? Dude, that was the weirdest thing in Ocarina of Time. When he would jump you automatically- can't go Oh with fuck, I thought, I, thought, I thought I was going down already. I just stopped. Alright, what was the weirdest thing about Ocarina of you Time? You fuck snakes! <laughs> <laughs> I don't fuck snakes. <laughs> That's disgusting. When you would jump, automatically, and it was like, what? This goes against all my gamer sensibilities. Yeah, but the game was designed like that. Yeah, but it was weird back then. It was like the it weird. was weird. I remember thinking that was weird. Like I'm jumping. Like what in, is yeah, the in, in, in the Kokiri Forest, we jump from the like pad to pad. Yeah, that weirded me out so bad. That's I can remember it. It weirded me out so bad. Fuck. <laughs> I'm okay. <laughs> you gotta start lighting those torches, dude. What are you Why? doing? I'm taking a shot in the dark. I've been doing pretty good so far. Oh man, pat yep, yourself yep, yep. on the back there. Hey, me? Yeah. I mean, like, I've been doing okay. I don't think so. Look, you don't even have any bombs, any arrows, or keys. <laughs> Shit! I better go gamble that 20 rupees. <laughs> Here's a clip from the last time we played Link to the Bats. <laughs> it's called Aaron Hansen Gambles with Rant Manson. See, I like this. We can just. <laughs> We can just take old clips from old episodes. The funny farts. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> well, okay, okay, I guess we might as well explain. We tried to fuck! Why didn't you tell me to light the lantern so I wouldn't miss anything? 
<laughs> Darn it, why? <laughs> why indeed? Okay, we, uh. we played this once before. To, um... Oh, there's the key. What the fuck? Okay. We, pl we played it to test our, our, our tools. Yeah. And we, we were... And we said funny things. Just... We said funny things, and now that it's the second playthrough... It's not, yeah. as, it's not as funny. Yeah, we're just, like, talking. For example, the there's a dick on the wall over there. The Kirby. Dash! A big throbbing wiener. Look, look, it's got like, it's got like, the underside is like perfectly, like it's even got like the big, I don't even know what it is, the urethra that like goes all the way down the bottom of the wiener. It's I'm very familiar with urethra. the bottom. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> the big, you know, the it's hot because of wieners. Glands. Shut your fucking mouth. <laughs> you know how the wiener <laughs> is not just the cylinder shaft. Cylinder? But, <laughs> but on the bottom, it has a bigger, it has like a wire going through. Yeah, it's fucking yeah, easy. it's like a, it's like that. <laughs> I can't <laughs> think, nobody can see what you're doing right now. It's like that. Exactly, yeah, okay. <laughs> Put on your penis. Just, <laughs> just so you know, JonTron was showing me the bottom of his lip. He was, he was, he was pulling, pulling his lip outward, we just so that I could see his gums. We should just add. Not, not he was not chewing gum, but he was showing me his his gums. Dude, you're gonna die. <laughs> we should add like Give a me that fucking controller. <laughs> Jesus Christ, you're the worst at this game. We should add a pan zip sound. So it's like, hey, this is what it looks like. <laughs> zip. Why are you showing me this? <laughs> of course, that's not gonna happen. None of this shit is getting edited in post. Dude. <laughs> Except for the one joke we're showing. We can't forget that. Versus Zelda, you're safe. Is this your doing group? <laughs> I like how, like, if I ever yes, it was Groom who helped me escape from the dungeon. <laughs> <laughs> oh when I was captured, the wizard said, Once I finish to do the final one, the seal of the wise men. Groom! <laughs> <laughs> you must not let the land of Hyrule fall into his clutches. <laughs> Every release of the seal of the seven wise men, there's something about Hyrule. The mighty evil, and then there's power, and then something about the master sword, and then there's the son of the wise men. See, I was saying this before. The Master Sword is the best thing ever in any in, in all video games. I think it's so clip. genius. No, I fucked the clips. I'll just explain it again. Okay, so the Master Sword. <laughs> just clips to other Let's Plays of the same <laughs> game that we've done. Check out this insight. Okay. Man. Okay. Shut your fucking mouth for a second. <laughs> um. Okay. What the fuck? So the Master Sword is the most genius thing in any fucking video game. The fact that like, it's like, okay, you're saving the kingdom, whatever. Like, you know, every game's about saving the kingdom. But like, <laughs> right- I'm sorry, that took me Here off I guard. Am. That did caught me off okay. guard. So, Go. every, every game's about saving the kingdom, saving the princess, whatever. But fucking Zelda's like, you're saving the kingdom, by the way, there's this awesome sword that's somewhere, and you can get it, and it makes you super strong, and that's like Where how you, you advance. Where it would just, you just said it in the conversation that we were just like fucking aiming the fuck through it. <laughs> he says the legendary master sword is the power to keep all the kingdoms. And okay, so he told me to go to the the this place on the map. Yeah. You see that? Do you see it? Oh, does that lady say it's in the forest? Yes. Okay. The lady that is on the X says that the master. She explains more about the master sword. It's awesome. It kicks ass, and it's in the forest. But I think it's even cooler, you don't like the fact that it's sealed away and you can't yeah, physically see it. Yeah, exactly. But I think it's even cooler that it's sealed away in like a fucking tomb. But I, I, see, I think... You got a lot from those. You, you hear... <laughs> the, oh, it's you, Groomp. <laughs> what can I do for you, young man, the Elder? No one has seen him since the wizard began collecting vis victims. What, Master... <laughs> I love that, just dot, 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 dot. Nobody's seen him since the wizard started collecting victims. So anyway, the Master Sword... <laughs> Well, well, I can't remember the detail. Like Shut your mouth. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. You always get it that way. Long ago, prosperous people known as the Hylia inhabited this land. Legends tell of many treasures that Hylia hid throughout the land. The Master Sword, a mighty blade forged against those of the evil hearts, is one of them. People say now it is sleeping deep in the forest. There it must be in the forest with the chipmunks. You understand monks. the legend. Anyway, look for the elder. There must be someone in the village who knows where he is. Take care now, group. That is cool. But, like, okay, an Ocarina of Time is behind the wall. And like, it's even it's more majestic, because that place is like... Yeah, okay. It's... I, I'll say it's a different kind of cool. It's, yeah, but it's I different. think, in my opinion, I think aesthetically, like, seeing it 
is more potent. No, okay. Because I, because like it's there and it's there and, and and there's like all this mysterious shit. Well, okay. To be fair though. Because like here I'll show you. You to be fair though, it would just be the same game if they did that. People, you just complained that they did the exact same thing. But it's all the little things. It's all the little things. So here, it's just I, like I, no, it's I like you go into the, the the forest and like right away you're like, oh, here's the master sword. No, yeah, this is it, the master sword. No. But if they did here, that again, it would just be three D Link to the past. It's like oh fuck. Okay, but look, they still handle it cool. I'm not saying you see. I'm I'm really not saying that the master sword in Ocarina of Time was executed poorly. I just think this was executed better. <sighs> to each his own. So like I'm gonna I'm going to find the master sword now. Where is it? Da, 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 da. You kill that person. Fucking, fucking kill that person. No, I don't care, dude. What do you think I am? Some kind dude, of animal abuser? You have to come. That's not what I meant to say. So you and it's like whoa, oh shit, what the? <gasps> Here it is. It's the fucking master sword. What does it say? Oh, it says. I, was, I can't uh, read it. You and then, and then you want to try to pull it out, but you can't. You can't pull it out. What do you got to do? You want to pull it out, but you can't. Stab it, stab it. It's so fucking, it's like, it's right there. It's, oh, it's right in my grasp. Like, there's something so cool about that. No, it's cool. Do you even, in Ocarina of Time, do you even know that the Master Sword is behind the walls of the Temple of Time? I'm not or do sure. You That's just what I was know, asking Or do you, you just know it exists? That's what I was asking you. Why are you collecting the pendants? I don't remember. In um, in Ocarina, I don't remember why you're collecting the. They're just like because in Ocarina, you you want to open the doors of the Temple of Time. But who I, who wants you to open it? It's the same. Zelda does. Zelda's the one who tells you about that shit. Oh, she just wants you to do it for her. Yeah. Secretly, isn't she like? I know that Gandorf's evil. And I want to do something to stop it, right? But then when you open the seal, it lets him win. Okay, so we'll catch you on the next. Puppisode of Game Grumps. We're gonna continue. <laughs> Puppisode? We're gonna continue right from where we are here. It's a series sort of thing, and that's what we're doing. See you soon. And welcome to another episode of Game Grumps! We're okay, doing, yeah. We're doing more. <laughs> we're doing more Link to the Past. That's the one. Hey, there's a fortune teller here. Wait a second! What's Go that? outside? Look at the, um... <laughs> Are Look at the logo! Are you saying that looks like Goatsy? It looks like Goatsy! Oh my god, it looks just like Goatsy! Ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> feast your eyes. Has anyone ever noticed that? Uh, show it to Reddit. Hold on. Reddit.com. I'm gonna go... Wait. No, don't eat... I'm gonna, I don't I'm care. Gonna no, wait, you're, just, you're gonna, wasting I'm our time. I'm gonna Google. Hmm, you look like you might have an interesting- well, while you're doing that, I'm gonna use our money to get some fortune No, salt. don't worry, we just got it again! <laughs> Do you not use money for anything in this game? What's money? Focus, focus. You will find the you elder Sahasrila. Now take twenty rupees. Thanks for the tip. Here's a tip. <laughs> you gave him a tip. <laughs> uh, I gave him a tip. Are Can you okay you... with it? I'm okay. I'm fucking fine. Why don't you just waste all our money? As you walk into this village, and the first door you go into is the door you have to go into. It's great. Oh wait, I already. <laughs> This I is already did this. This is yeah. This is Kakariko Village. <laughs> I didn't talk to this person. All right. Yep. It's, they've no. The, yeah. Mo people have noticed it, but I've never seen that before. <laughs> Holy crap! Oh, so the woman told me that I need to go. Well, what's this guy? He's the bottle seller. You're gonna go through life holding any bottles? Step right up. I have a little hundred rupees. I wonder if we're gonna get money. <laughs> I wonder if we're gonna get money. <laughs> we're gonna get money from. You shut your goddamn face, <laughs> dude. This is, Oh, Groom! You know what's funny? The say you kidnapped a princess, but I still oh, trust you. Oh, Groom! <laughs> what a nice lady. Dude, I- This guy doesn't trust me. Dude, that guy's a f uh, funny- What? What? He was just- Get him, get him, get him, kiss it. So if he- and then he's- Get the- Get him, get him, get him, kiss it. Ah, son of a bitch. I can't you get him. throw the boomerang at him. The boomerang? The boomerang. Oh, I should do that. I should throw the boomerang at him. Boomerang. Boomerang me, I said, uh- Said, hey, oh, boomerang. My mama said to go to rehab. I didn't go, but then I died. The boomerang does nothing. Dude, that kid is like fearless. Lightning fast. Look at that. What the fuck? That's bullshit. What the fuck? I gotta like blow my nose. Do it. Hey, hey, hey groom. Elder, are you talking about the grandpa? Okay, but don't tell any of these bad people about this, all right? He's hiding in the palace past the castle. Oh, will mark the spot on your map. Here you are. All right. Let me see where it is. Okay, it's over there. You know, I didn't realize till after I played Ocarina of Time that this is the same Kakariko village. And it's actually in Twilight Princess 2, but it like sucks. In Twilight Princess, it's like it has none of the same feel of Kakariko Village. 
It's like a, like an Indian town, like Native American Indian, not like Hindu. Oh yeah, I remember that. It, it, it goes like... And it's like, bom, 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 like that Indian kind of <laughs> tribal sound. Pay me 20 rubies and I'll let you open a chest. Of course I'll do it. But you fucking, we gotta get a bottle. Look at that. You got lucky. Look at that. You just got lucky, you punk. This is what, uh, my luck's turning around. But you ended up with the same amount of you didn't use the fortune teller. <laughs> like fortune smeller. No, I spent 20 on the fortune teller and I got, I made a profit of 30 with that guy. More like fortune smeller. So fuck your face. Oh Jesus, I'm sorry. Oh God. <laughs> <laughs> that really fucked. Dude, look at that arrow pointing. It's like a middle finger. What's up here? Smell you later. What's up here? Fortune smeller. What's up? Oh shit. What? I don't remember this guy. Is that Tingle? It's Tingle. Wait, who is that? Seriously. That's Wait, what the fuck is that? He has the Ocarina of Time. Does he? Yeah. Wait, no way. Yeah, he does. So that's from this? Yeah. Wait, what's... He, are, you sh are you shitting me? No, I'm not shitting you. Why does he have the Ocarina of Time? Because it's his thing. Who is he? He's just a fucking dude. He's an Ocarina player. They call it a flute in this one. So it's not... It, it, it's clearly an ocarina. It's blue and it's the same shape. But they call it a flute because I don't think they thought many Americans knew what ocarinas were. Oh, okay. See ya! Can you go back and see him? Yeah. Go back, I want to see it. Well, it's okay. it's it's a thing later. Shut your goddamn fucking face. I turned around to say it to you, like, as Link. Did you? <laughs> yeah. I was like, shut your goddamn face. <laughs> I will drill you. Well, hold on a sec. What's with that fucking Tron bridge? This game sucks. <laughs> Let's cut. Let's cut. What's with these stupid faces? What's with these dumb faces? This game's bad. This game Why are the flowers dancing? There's nothing to dance about. The world is being the taken world's over. in peril! Dude, check it out. It's Octorok. No, it's There's another Octorok up here. There's one. I was saying, those guys look like the space jockeys. The, the engineers? Yeah. From, uh, They're not pr pr fucking Prometheus. engineer. Okay. Prometheus. That engineer thing was the space jockey from the first film, and they fucked it up. Although I like Prometheus, but they really fucked up the right. lore. So this guy, this guy's my favorite because you, if you give and him a little, you, if you get <laughs> <laughs> M, M Night Shalhasra, <laughs> if you, if, if you um, if if you read his dialogue with a little sass, he's awesome. Okay. Yeah. I am indeed Sahasra, the village elder of a descendant of the Seven Wise Men. Oh really? Groom? I'm surprised a young man like you is searching for the Sword of Evil's Bane. Not just anyone can use that weapon. Legends say only the hero who has won three pendants can wield the sword. Do you really want to find it? Of course! Were you abused as a child? Good. As a test, can you retrieve the Pendant of Courage from the East Palace? If you bring it here, I'll tell you more about the legend Give you a magical artifact. Now, go forward to the palace. Have you? Is that like the first thing you thought when you when you were a kid and you saw this guy? And you're like, it'd be really funny if he said it funny. What was the first thing that you thought of when you were a kid? I'm a fucking idiot. <laughs> I thought you were just gonna go. <laughs> I think it probably would have been better. <laughs> it was the first thing you thought. <laughs> <laughs> it was the first thing you thought when you were a baby. Go, go, Gaga! <laughs> go, go, Gaga! Where's my bow? I got arrows, but no bow to use. <laughs> I'm a fucking baby. <laughs> That's like baby godfather meme. <laughs> I'm a fucking baby. What do I Somebody do? Somebody bring him back here. Alright, so I gotta, got I gotta go into here and I gotta get the Prometheus. Prometheus okay. Space Jackie. Space Jukey. See, I love these guys right here. <laughs> these statues. Yeah, they, they look like Dr. Robotnik to me. <laughs> do you think those are hands or are those like part of the mustache? No, it's totally hands. They're like, oh, hey! <laughs> you wanna come in the temple right now? They just look more like they're like, meh. <laughs> anyway. Here we go, first temple. There's a button, bam. See, like, you always are saying, all right, ego shmigo over here. What the fuck was that? Okay. He's hey, so you know what? You know what? Here, this is you're gonna shit on this game, so why don't you play it instead oh, of me? Good. I just handed the controller to John. I'm not shitting on it. You know what? I, <laughs> I think these balls are shitting on you. Oh shit! You gotta watch out for the big one, dude. Ooh. Pause balls by going upstairs. Pause balls by going downstairs. That's the best strategy in the game. Gonna go upstairs and pause balls. <laughs> 
<laughs> not bad. Too chase. <laughs> okay, so visually, <laughs> we've talked about this yeah. many a time. So many times. Okay. But you can see e the treasure chest yeah. right there. Ego thinks it's cool that you can see. We can't really right now, but. You can see the treasure chest physically. So once again, it's, it's physical it's, seeing. It's on like a pedestal, Shit. and you can see it, and it's exciting. It gives you when you enter a dungeon, you're like, all right, what's this dungeon all about? And you you're, you're led like a little bit through the dungeon. You're like, oh, there's these balls, whatever. And then you see a treasure chest, and right away you're like, I'm gonna get that fucking treasure. Okay, chest. the problem. What though, do I gotta do to get to that treasure chest? But Ocarina I, doesn't have that. But I think it's more interesting when you just walk into a dungeon, and the okay, the dungeon. This dungeon is obviously just like a game. It's like, oh, we're just playing a game. You know what I mean? Like, it's whatever. But Ocarina, you walk into, like, the fucking fire temple, and it's like the Goron's, like, shrine, and you're like, this is mysterious. And you walk into a room, and the door closes behind you, and, like, a monster comes to the ceiling, it's like, ba da da I'm sure everyone wants to hear my soundtrack of... How does it go again? Anyways, all right. <laughs> Even though so, enough of that, you fight a mini boss, and that? shit, and um, I don't know. You just. It's more mysterious. But you do that in this, too. There's many bosses. Yeah, but it's just like... And each room is a challenge. Okay, it's I'm like, not, what's I'm, going on in okay. this room? Okay, there's there's a thing, and now it's like, oh, do I go down? Well, I guess I have to. I'm I can not, go back up. I'm not saying the game is bad. I'm just saying... I feel like it doesn't compare to Ocarina very much. So you, you're you saying, thematically, Ocarina is better. Yeah, so it's sure, got sure. The Fire Temple, and everything in the Fire Temple is lava, there's fire bats. And there's a not that bland, not that plainly, just like, it has, a lot of this feels like level for the sake of- Why are you going back? Why are you going Am back? I going the wrong way? A lot of this feels like level for the sake of, of being a level, whereas Ocarina of Time feels like- But it's a challenge, each room is like a little puzzle, it's a little challenge. Well, it's like that in Ocarina too. Except more interesting. <laughs> <laughs> like, that's all. Uh, but you don't feel that giving the player- an incentive, like a fucking chest. There is incentive! You know there's gonna be something in there! But you don't think that's... You think that the, the, just like the mystique of like walking into a... A temple that's like, oh, it's a fire temple. Yeah. Is more interesting? Well, cause you walk in and you like see the like... There's like the opening room and you're just like, what? I will say there's stuff in Ocarina that's, that's decent. Like, for example, I think it's the fire temple. Or maybe it's the first... It's just the Goron temple or whatever. When you walk in and there's like the big skeleton on the wall, like the big skull, like the, oh, the dragon skull, yeah, the that was Dongo the, that's skull. the Dongo's cavern. That's cool. Like you walk in, it's like, whoa, what's that all about? Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. They feel really different. Where these just feel like arranged rectangles. You feel like arranged rectangles. And I'm not saying that's bad because this is like fun. It's fun to just like sit down and play. But it's not. It doesn't have the same like emotional moving factor that like Ocarina of Time has. And on that note, we're gonna end here. And we're gonna come back soon for another Link to the Past Let's Play. Oh god, did I just call it that? Link to the Past Let's Play. Link to the Past, we're you, playing a game. Why did you use that dirty word? Why did I use that dirty word? Well, we do real stuff on our channels, so we're entitled to play video games. On the line. Shut up, bye! Bye! And we're back with Link to the Past. I'm so excited about what we're playing. <laughs> John Tron's got the controller and he's been fucking around all day. <laughs> so sick of his bullshit. Dude, whoa! You should have seen what happened in the last episode. Holy shit. Whoa, Let's just it, take was a look. A, it was incredible. Let's take a look. Let's play the whole last episode. <laughs> <laughs> so check it out. Now you're here. You're like, it's yeah, I got this chest. Oh, it's locked. It's locked. Oh, bullshit. You need a key. Bullshit. Now I'm just Bullshit. You did lock. Fuck that. Lock chest. Fuck that. <laughs> you oh, really shit fit on you? A chest shouldn't be locked. <laughs> but it's a big chest. Dude, dude, sh dude fuck you. Dude, fuck this. Dude, uh, fuck so you that. try to find the big key and you're like, oh shit, where is oh, it? God. I gotta get it. I gotta get it. Hold on, I gotta teach this guy a lesson of three. Lesson of three. The big key's in this guy. Boom! Oh. There it is. Wait, is that the boss key? Alright, I gotta take this guy down. There. <laughs> but why? Isn't you not supposed to? But why? Why not? I guess you can. Oh! Oh, there you go. Yeah, I wanted a heart, mainly. Just I wanted someone alone. <laughs> Cyclops weakness. <laughs> Pots. <laughs> He's very anti -drug. You already went down there. Shit. 
What does this say? It's the Hasrala. It is well, I, Sumshrimness. I can, I can talk, talk to you telepathically when you touch these tiles. Here's a hint. You can use the treasure hidden in this palace to feed armored foes. Wait, like the pots? <laughs> the treasure. The fucking treasure. Oh. It's in the treasure chest. <laughs> you dumb fuck. <laughs> Uh, See, the reason I get this so- This is the pot dungeon. This, the reason that I get so lost is because it all looks the same. You look the same. As me? Yeah. Yeah. I like, shit, it's, it's, it's tangled up! <laughs> you okay. get so lost because you're not paying attention. No, because I you're don't give a fuck. entertaining on screen. Look, there's a button right there. And you open the door. Guess we're just gonna find a mini boss. Should be a mini boss. There's Stalfos. Are these Stalfos? Yeah. Gibdos. No, Gibdos are the mummies. Yeah, but... I think they're not called that in this. St no, you know what? Stalfos are in this. And they're, uh, they're, they're bigger. Those are Gibdos. Are they? I thought Gibdos were the... They are in the Ocarina. Zone. They are in right, Ocarina. you know what? Fuck this shit. Okay, get the manual. I'm going, I'm, I'm going full on... Get that manual, baby. Touch me in my manual balls. You know what I should do? I should look at the, uh, strategy guide. Prima official. Win. Dude, past. if you can, uh, man, it's a shame that we're not filming because your wall has a ton of. Whoa, the pots do one shot those guys. Yeah, the pots are fucking awesome. You can use the treasure to fight them. That's what I thought they meant because the pot one shot him. All right, let me see if Dude, I can find the name of these enemies. Ego has a fucking like a Game Boy SNES. A Game Boy SNES. Yeah. The fuck? Oh, the Super Boy? Yeah. It's available now, eighty dollars. Superboy.com. I don't even know if that's true. And, and that's the day they made all the money. <laughs> Alright, is this a list of enemies? The there is in the- you have the link to the past. I box. know, but I don't want to open the box. I just wanna- You've never opened it? Here we go, battling foes. Oh wait, these are all bosses. Well- There's a spoilers! Shit, I don't want to get spoilers for this game. What? Oh. It was like- it was like a list of all the bosses. I was like, no. Alright, alright. We're gonna find this out. I'm sure everybody online's already fucking Googled this shit. Yeah. <laughs> they're like, this is. <laughs> I'm pretty. These are just wasting my time. Oh my god, what the. Dude. What's Do that? what? Their heads were coming at me. This is good I, I'm pretty decently sure they're not Stalfos. I right. think they're Gibdos. I think ones. you're right, but I don't think they're Gibdos. I think the Stalfos are the big ones. With the sword and the shield. Yeah, those are the Stalfos. Wait, what are Gibdos then? They're the fucking. No, I know what they are in Ocarina of Time, but what are Gibdos They're in? They're the mummies. But there are no mummies in this. They're the mummies in the original. I don't think Gibdos are in this. We'll find out. We're only a page away. Stalfos. So yeah, Gibdos are the fucking mummies. Oh yeah, they are in this. Okay, never mind then. Gibdos you can use are the fire in this rod. Game. Yeah, the Stalfos is the one with the sword and the shield. I know they are that in Ocarina. They don't even have a thing for the those skeletons. They're just called. Duh. <laughs> we didn't. Duh. <laughs> Skeleton. Dude, Gibdos in Ocarina were weird because they were um. Were they the Redeads? No, they were ba they were just Redeads, but they had like as like a mummy skin basically. It was really weird because they didn't show up that often. I think they were slightly stronger or something. But dude, you want to know the the creepiest enemy, like scariest enemy from like any game? Redeads. No, fucking dead hand. It only shows up like once. I think it's in Majora's Mask too. Dead it's in the bottom of the well. It's like that. It's like that zombie guy who has like any like the, his hands come out of the ground, and he grabs you and then he comes towards you really slow. I don't remember that at all. Dude, it only shows up like once in the game, and it's like the scariest fucking enemy. Maybe we should play Majora's Mask. Maybe? When we're done playing this game. Alright, dude. Audience, what do you think? <laughs> you should send us a text tweet... <laughs> a tweet text at www. I'm not gonna answer that dot com. <laughs> I'm not gonna what? I'm not gonna answer your text tweet dot com. <laughs> dude, you gotta no. shoot him with the treasure. You got... Yeah. Seriously, comment right now if you would like him to wear his mask. Fucking of course they... No! Fucking lure people in. What are they gonna say? No! No, nah, don't do it. No, it's more if they did actually respond, like, yes, please. Okay. Like, okay, but like, 
I want to. You want to play Conker's Bad Fur Day? And enjoy, we just fucking play everything all the. Do you understand how much we can upload like eight hundred of these a day? <laughs> <laughs> I like how it's almost like shoot, we can't do that. We're limited. We're not limited by any means. That's right. It will probably play more video games than I've ever played in my life I know. by doing this, dude. Like, okay, like I think I can speak for both of us. We're like, we both love video games. We're we're children at heart. Like, but, like, we're, we're, we're always messing around. But, like, we generally don't have time to play games, because we're always, like, working or thinking about stuff like that. But, like, yeah, the fact that now we're doing this for, like, a channel, we're gonna play games more than we, like, even were when kids, probably. Yeah, definitely. Well, I don't know about that. I remember, I remember I, uh, I came home from school, and I played Super Mario Sunshine, and I got all of the shines in three days. Yeah, okay, maybe not not as much as when we were kids, but we're definitely gonna be playing more than we have in the in the recent years. It's so weird because it's so far far away in my memory. Like I, I, I just like I came home from school and I played Mario Sunshine until I went to bed, and then I woke up. I probably played Mario Sunshine before I went to yeah. school. Yeah, isn't it weird that you school and I came that? home? Yeah, that's crazy. This game is actually I'm digging this game right now. Actually, it's good. Cool, man. I, I told you I liked it. I just don't like it as much as Ocarina. I don't think it's even comparable. I think they are highly comparable, and that's why I'm making a show about it. <laughs> yeah, that's why you didn't want to do this because you didn't want to give your. No, but you know what? You know what? Your your thoughts about theming, those are things to keep into consideration. I think. What do you mean? Because it's true, the dungeons in this game aren't themed as much as the dungeons in Ocarina. Yeah, and that's just a part like. It just feels more mysterious, too. I can't- it's, it's almost like a feeling. I can't really- Fuck! Fuck! Get out of here! Go! Get out! I love how they just bounce. They're like, oh, we're gonna get you. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> they, they bounce, like, delicately, too. They're not like, boom, boom, oh. boom. They're just like, boop, boop. The equivalent of that enemy in Ocarina are fucking horrifying. Oh, yeah. And they, like, when you hit them and they die, yeah, they're they like, <laughs> Yeah, they do the thing that you were doing in, in Kirby. Like, <laughs> <laughs> That's a reference to our Kirby episode. Yeah. Uh, cut, cut to it. Just click, click the screen. You can get a link <laughs> screen, to it right now. Click the screen, you'll pause the video. <laughs> then you can unpause click, it. Click the annotation that says, uh, this is in the Kirby video. <laughs> Bum. Bum. That's a good shot. Oh, that was my last arrow. It's a harp now. That's a good shit on our arrow supplies. That's it! <laughs> the integrity of this show has gone down to shit. I can't believe. Go back to Hasab Safrella. Hey there. <laughs> Walk a little bit more. Dude, dude, where's the Sarandis? Just go left. Susan Sarandis? Susan Sarandis. Susan Sarasarola? San Sandis Sarandis. There it is, there he is. He's in that little hut. He's a, he's a gingerbread house. He's in a little hut. Do you want to play? No. <laughs> Why would I play this fucking game? <laughs> oh? Oh, you got the pen. I'm not That's even nice. letting you. <laughs> I'm not letting you. Unfortunately, it was more than nice. I see you, Groom. I believe you. I believe you. Oh. Okay, so he's telling you to get the pendants because you need them for the <laughs> master sword. Just pull a shoe out of his ass. Yeah. <laughs> it gives you the dash attack. Yeah, you're gonna go catch. You can know you can do it kid. on the wall. I'm gonna catch the fuck out of that kit. Wait. You just need to do it. You just hit A. Oh, that's right. Okay. What the? F can't break a pot, but you break a wall. Good. <laughs> Good. That annoys me actually that you can't break uh, pots like. Okay, that see, before. fucking three, three fucking, three treasure chests. Bam, get the rubies. Bam, get the rubies. It's done. You don't have to fucking sit there while Link is like, like, what the fuck? I, oh my god. No, I, I, uh, that, that's something we agree on. Okay. I, it's so annoying when, yeah, when he, when, when he'll just be like, oh god, Skyward Sword is the worst. You saw it. It was like, yeah. this is a thing. You know how many of these you have in your inventory? Let's fade out. <laughs> Let's fade in. Ding! You have one more of those. Fade out. Fade in. Like, it's unbelievable amount of time wasted. And it happens every time you reset the game. It's unbelievable! Unbelievable. Ba -boom. Fuck that but seriously, yeah, I don't think there's a there's a spot in Ocarina where they had like multiple treasure chests just because it's so obnoxious to, to open up multiple treasure chests and at one time. The, the games are just different. Like in the, the treasure chests like were more like a like grand in Ocarina. But the ones that have rupees you just kick open and it's like doo -doo 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 -doo. There's still there's still chests where you open it up Trests? and there's fucking rupees inside that are like the big ones. Uh, da -da -da -da! But it's only if it's like a hundred. I got twenty rupees. No, only if it's like a hundred rupee. All right, I'd like to. I, you know, I'd like to find out. I'm I'm a hundred percent sure on this. If it's, but even still, if, if it's, it's just a fucking or... tiny rupee, you like kick it and it's still a cutscene and then a fucking dialogue box that says you got I, I five rupees. <laughs> Stuck <Start> my wiener. <laughs> I always thought the the little kick was cool. Yeah, it's cool and fucking Ninja Gaiden. Does he do it? 
Anyways, <laughs> fucking uh, hit, hit the hit the map. You did the goo. Hold on. The goo gooed. Hold on. Susan Sarandon told you that you need to. Oh. <laughs> you Sorry. need to open up the thing and look at your pendants. Look at your pendants. You gotta look at the map. You gotta. <laughs> I'm not even fucking kidding. Okay. Look at your map. What? You gotta go to the penance now. I got it. I tried to get out of here. Get the two other ones. I know how to fucking I beat. Fucking <laughs> I've almost beat this game. Welcome anyway, to Game Grumps. Okay, okay. Speaking of that, we'll catch you on the next episode. We're gonna be continuing our journey. Link into the part. Okay. Link to the part. <laughs> Welcome to Game Groups. Game Groups. Game Groups. We're playing as Group, the Legend of Group. Group Groups. Le Legend of Group. Lovers. Wait, go over to the right. Go over to the right. There's no right. There's... <laughs> what is this, fucking matrix? I didn't really... <laughs> go into that hole in the wall. I don't trust this. <laughs> go in the hole in the chocolate mountain. It's a, car, it's a, a layer cake. Fuck. What the... Did you hit him? Yeah. Oh, you shot your... How did anyway, you go know? In the... <laughs> How did you You're think... good. Oh! Wait, no, I was gonna walk around you. Damn it, I was gonna like- Dude, she shot her essence at you. <laughs> Even was... if you were over there, she was just like, I got you. <laughs> Don't worry. <laughs> it's like a cutscene where it's like, oh, I could only shoot it forward. <laughs> it's like, I got you. Don't worry. <laughs> Dude. What are you, up in the sky? Yeah. No problem. I got you. <laughs> Shoots at Adrian. <laughs> what are you, outside the cave? No worries. It's, gonna, it's a homing device. <laughs> okay, can you go up? To, you, no, to, you want to go to the, the sand. Plane? No, you want to go to the sand. Well, isn't that fucking where I'm going? No, you want to go down. You don't want to go, go to that one. You sure, you can try, but. Can you go out of order? Um, I don't think so. Holy shit! This guy's on his shit. I'm out. <laughs> Dude, we gotta play Majora's. Okay, we'll play Majora's Mask and Conquer's Bad for a day, the whole way through. That's our that's our playlets. What? Yeah. I didn't even say that. <laughs> you didn't, I'm sorry. I didn't say such a hey, hey, hey. word. Now that you have the Pegasus bootses. I'm gonna go catch the fucking kid. Oh, Where you should. Oh, no, it's too far away. Where's the village? Oh, well, yeah, go there? ahead. Go to. Go, uh, unpause. First of all. First of all. Go left. <laughs> and then go up. You can you can destroy the five blocks now with your Pegasus bootses. What, what are those? Like mushrooms? They're just rocks. They're fucking weird. They're rocks on top of each other. Oh! <laughs> that image, like I can just imagine a cutscene of that. Just like Link walks in, like, oh, <laughs> starts swiping at him. Just like really slowly. Like, why won't they die? Why can't they die? Did, did, did. You go down. Go down. You want to go? Well, no, down. I want to go to Kuroku no, you go Village. Down. You can't though. Why? Wait, you can. Go down. <laughs> I want to get a bottle. You want to get a bottle? We have. You have the money. We have the technology. I knew you were gonna go there. You have the 255 rupee. Rupees? Isn't, isn't there a nation in the world that their currency is actually rupees? Yeah, India, I think. India. Please, God. Go I'm, left! I, what are you doing? I, I think it's India, right? You're fucking I don't want to be wrong, because okay. I'll look like a really dumb... Internet, dude. email us. <laughs> www.gamergrump.grump <laughs> email, email us. Gamergrumps at email.gem Email.gem Gamegrumps at gmail.com. That's I think that's the real one. Yeah, that one. is it. Game Emails. Grumps. Don't actually email. send all your fan mail. Send your fan mail like, like how have you guys finally fucking <laughs> just send all your fan mail like have you finally resorted to this? <laughs> <laughs> have you finally stooped so low? Dude, what are you? You're so crazy. What? You're so crazy. What are you drunk? What are you high? <laughs> Hold on. What are we referring to? My bad play? No, check it out. Go in there. There's a bookstore. I don't want a fucking book. I'm trying yes, to play you want a video book. game. Even when I'm trying to play video game, you're trying to get me to read book. <laughs> but it's a good book. <laughs> I suppose you want me to mow the grass. This is before the Kindle. I saw your Kindle actually. Thanks. <laughs> Look at that. There's a book up there. That's something that you say thanks. Yeah. <laughs> I saw your Kindle. Thanks. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> I left it out for you to notice. Oh yeah, I'm yeah, glad yeah, you yeah, noticed. Fucking, I did this before. No, you didn't. I've done it before! Why? Because it's obviously to be hit! It's the Book of Medora. What is that? It's the Book of Medora. Is it- is It can it... translate Hylian. If you read the fucking text, it would- you would know. I don't read. Cause you're trying to get me to read books in the middle, I'm trying to play Modern Warfare. 
This is not Modern Warfare. This is 100 Modern points. Warfare. Care package. UAV. Um, <laughs> tactical nuke. Call for a dead strike. Go up. You're so dumb. I don't know this guy. You're so dumb. Okay, I bet if we played Ocarina, you'd be like, I wonder what's over there. And I'd be like, how can you don't know the exact bit? Shit, I have a stroke. God. I go to your beard. <laughs> Why don't you know it? Why don't you so dumb? You dummy. Why don't you know the exact beard? Go to your beard. Catch. Wait, what? Why did I stop? You fucked up. You fucked up. Catch. Wait. What? You gotta, you gotta like trigger him and then catch him. Ah, uh, he's gone. He's gone. That is magic. That <laughs> just happened. Do you believe in it? You can't. You gotta stop. Stop. You gotta stop and then get him again. You get him, get him, get him, get him. Oh, this he's kid up. runs into the fucking tree. You gotta, you gotta walk up to him and then fucking chase him. A wise man once told me, "Where'd he go? He's like gone for dude, a dude." You fucking spawn killed him. <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit, he's just gone forever. I must have like tagged him with the very end of my. Just clipped him with your sword, and he just fell over dead in the shrubs. <laughs> you gotta fucking trigger it before you do. You stupid. I thought I did. You're a bozo. You're a bozo. You're a bozo. He's not there anymore. You <laughs> killed him <laughs> in the shrubs. Fuck. <laughs> All right, you Dude, gotta you gotta wait until he starts walking backwards, and like, then you can do it. I like how in this game you can be like, you could be like, you could be like, dun 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 I can't, I can't believe you caught me! Go ahead and read it yourself. I noticed oh, you were starting. He thinks... He thinks that we capture Zelda. Yeah, oh, that's right! Everybody thinks that we capture your, him. Your wanted poster is all over the Why land. Why is that? Because Aghanim is a dickhole, and he's, he like, manipulating everybody. You? Yeah, he just put up a bunch of wanted posters. On just one kid? Yeah. Do you know you're the hero of time? Yeah. How? Well, they don't know that you're the hero of time. They just know that you're a hero. No. Wait, hold Look on. Look at you, you got a sword and shield. Does she have a sword and shield? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Why is she sweeping the grass? Hold on. Hold on. John, why is she sweeping the grass? God, that's a good I always wonder that too. Okay, no. Seriously. He is... What was he before this game started? Just a kid, right? I guess. So well, then, he was, he was, yeah, he was the... Yeah. No, Zelda is your... He's something. He's connected to Zelda somehow. Oh. Why do you live in a shack then? I don't know, his fucking uncle beats him. Rapes him. Oh, that's bad. I'm sorry, Link. This be it. This is so be it. Oh, you suck my place. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. You suck my wiener. Oh, yeah. Suck, you suck that's my dick. Oh, my God. Dude, why don't you talk to these people? You little fuck. A oh, group is here. <laughs> it's here. Get out. Get out. Get out. Get out. Get out. Get out. Go. I'll give you a warning. All right, that's it. All right, he's dead. You buy a bottle right now. You. I'm going to buy it from his ear. Low price of 100 rupees. Would you see interested? I'll take one. Goodbye. Thanks a lot. Did you really hold, it above, hold it above your head? That's adorable. That's so fourth wall breaking. Dude, they broke the. That's like the only time. Wait, no, it's not. Dude, Mallow from fucking Twilight Princess is the weirdest character they've ever made. It's like the baby that can talk and like starts a store. Dude, not fucking not Mallow. Fucking Uckos. Ukos too. Do you know? Do you know the reasoning behind? Yeah, the, the, origi you know the original gaming? color. Yeah. Did you know that for Did you know gaming? I, uh, yes, I did actually. I did not know that. But it wasn't like a. It wasn't like a. It would have been like. Do you know why they called Oko Oko? And I would have been like, Oh shit. Yeah. Yeah. I just thought it was a cool name because it sounds like Kuko. Yeah. Hexadecimal. Dude, in Twilight Princess, there's this part where. You can like jump off the Hi Lake Hylia's thing with chickens, and like if you hit the chickens enough up there, you turn into the chicken, and you can walk it off the edge. So I did that with all the chickens and walked them off the edge, and then I talked to the guy and he's like, "Where all my chickens go?" And I was like, "That's it." That whole th I must have missed something, but it was like I literally just turned into all your chickens, walked them off, and that's the only reward I get. It was just him going, "I guess my chickens are gone." <laughs> Like, wait, so if you attack the chickens... Yeah, there's a bunch of chickens in the area that you, he's like, grab one and fly off with it. It's like a little game. You can attack the chickens enough, you turn into the chicken. Like, he's, Link is still standing there, but you control the chicken. 
it like fades out and fades back in and you're the chicken. So I did it with every single one of the chickens. And it didn't amount to anything. Well, maybe you have to do something as the chicken. Maybe there's like a little hole you can climb into or Possibly. something. Possibly. I don't remember. I remember there was something about that. Because I, I remember it from the first time I played the game. Check this shit out. Gra grab something? Never mind. Don't even... What? I don't care. What? Keep going. Grab what? Just, I don't care. Oh, just keep going. I'm going back. You motherfucker! Just get- go! You told me to grab- Just go! I don't want- I, I, I'm just, Forget it. Forget it. I'm I was grab. wrong. I was wrong. What? Now what? That's it. What? Just keep going now. What? Just keep going. What was it? 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 Just keep going. What was it though? 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 Alright, go 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 over to the right. Why? Right. Why are you skipping that, man? Why are you skipping that? Skipping what? Skipping this part. This little thing right here. I'm not skipping anything. This you told me to go to. There's a little thing right there. You're telling it's me to rush. Want to explore? No. I hate this fucking game. All right, let's see. Whoa. Is uh, that Johnny Depp on the? Do you see Johnny Depp? I saw Goatsy earlier. Do you see Johnny Depp right there from Pirates of the Caribbean? It's Johnny Depp. <laughs> oh, you mean when he's like at World's End? <laughs> when he's at World's End. Yeah. Whatever. Okay, is this gonna be a real piece? Oh, there you go. You got bombs. Great, booms. What about that door? You wanna go to the door? All I know is, see you next time... ...on the next Game Grumps. Mm -hmm. Why don't we find out what's in that door on the next episode of the Game Grumps? Yeah, why don't we find out what's in that door on the next episode of the Game Grumps? And we're about to find out what's in that door! On the next episode, <laughs> episode of Game, Game Grumps. Well, it's a current episode of Game Grumps, so. <sighs> um, You know, it's so great how great we get a Long John. Isn't it? Long John. <laughs> I'm not- I, I don't know if you were being sarcastic with me, or serious. <laughs> Long John? Not that part. Long the John? Part. The other part. Long John? We do get along pretty well. No. <laughs> <laughs> I've never told you how much I hate you, though. Oh, Pick yeah. the wrong one, and you get the bombs. Oh! What are you doing, leaving? I thought you said to... I get the bombs. It's still there. Oh. And right, now you open that one, and you get the water. <sighs> Is that necessary to do? Yeah, it's amazing. Amazing? It's amazing. Get it? Because it looks like a maze. It didn't look like a maze. <laughs> it looked like a fucking turn. Whoa! A piece of ho oh, Holy that Holy shit. At what price I killed these fish? Can you Why kick you it like a Mario? Take a fish to grab it. Grab it. Grab it. Grab the fish. Alright, just go, go up. Feed it to the buzzard. Just go up. Feed it to the buzzard. Just keep going. Feed it to the buzzard. Just keep going up. Go to the right. Just throw it in the whirlpool. Woo! <laughs> oh. Oh. I know, what a nice guy. You don't have to throw in the whirlpool, do you? Yeah. Just in the water. Just in the water. Why'd you make it throw in the whirlpool? Because you just throw in the water. Oh. Isn't that nice? That nice. It's a little fish. We got a piece of heart, a piece of ass, and a nice 20 rupee. And a piece of bass. Get it? That's <laughs> like, that was oh, nice. Thanks. That was nice. Thanks. That was nice. This has led up to this whole thing. So this is a whole hour. <laughs> the whole game grumps thing. Hour just so you can make that joke. Just make that joke. Bum, bum, bum. I'm making music. Do you actually do that well? Who's this, Mario? Oh, he doesn't have much to say. Okay. Why don't you read the fucking sign next to him? Maybe that'll give you some insight on him. There you go. I'm not. Maybe. <laughs> You want dance? <laughs> you want some shrooms? Okay, he didn't want that. Hey, you want some- you want some hot drugs? <laughs> oh, the same word. Hold on. Hey, yeah. <laughs> I don't know. Well, that guy's just stone cold dead. That's what that is. Did they read to him? Read him a bedtime story? Why is this even in, like, my inventory? The book? Shouldn't it be in, like, my passive Tory? You're a passive. Why don't you go in the fucking cave? Why did you- Why, why did you, do I have to go? Why did you just get up the cave and then stop? Because I wanted to go the it's other- It's a cave! One. But I mean like, it showed the- oh, hey. Check that out. <laughs> Check out what was here. God. <laughs> you know like every fucking Kravis? Yes. Every little Lenny yes. Kravitz? I know every little- every little American woman. Get away from me. Don't you come knocking around my door. Or I'm gonna... I don't wanna see your shoulder. shadow no more. Something about what? getting hypnotized. He's like, I love him. Yeah, he's he like... Remote. <laughs> <laughs> Let me tell you that joke. <laughs> I need a battery fitting. <laughs> Louder with a scary monster. 
<laughs> That's what for some reason is what it reminds me of. <laughs> get out of here, buzzard! <laughs> get out of here! The buzz off, get it? <laughs> I could literally make a music video out of this. <laughs> Continue would do well with this. They put the all day, all day, all night, all day. They do the song that they put. Whoa, those cattle were definitely walking in a line. <laughs> they just what they just all died? Is that a landmine? Alright, is this is this like some fucking Oh, 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 God. Load it, load it. Fuck. <laughs> load it, load it, load it. Shake you what your mama gave you. Oh, God, I have to start from Groom's house? <laughs> Groom has a, his mom makes great curry. What? You fucking... I don't want to... Oh, my God, you're such a baby. Only baby here, okay, is Mr. Baby. <laughs> Over in the... There's no baby there. What do you say? What are you talking about babies for? <laughs> you called me a baby. I called you a baby because you're a baby. You're bringing up babies like they're, they're the, the hot you topic. You didn't even eat your chicken, Alfredo! <laughs> Shut your goddamn face. I ate plenty of chicken, Alfredo. I you just made it good. I want me, more of it now. You gave me seconds. Did hey. you give me all of it? No. All of the remainder? Why don't you have some then? Put it in the microwave. We're we talking about our fucking. <laughs> today. <laughs> 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 Ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> I literally made Josh Ron's drink come out of his nose. Congratulations. I'm gonna puke! This is- this is Game Grumps. Oh my god! Ladies and gentlemen, this is Game Grumps. It took me so long to swallow that. I just- because I realized that we were just passively talking about- <laughs> You're like, would you warm it up? <laughs> I don't think- Why don't you go put it in the microwave? I don't know if my mom will let me. <laughs> Alright. 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 Alright, John Tron. What's up? Does this not look like a octopus? really weird octopus? No, I saw that. He's just like, Ah. I know, he's like, what's going on? Is, he, is this supposed to Why be a Why are there so many cows? Is this supposed to be a hot couplet? I think so. Shit. Why are there so many cows? This is the funniest fucking zone. <laughs> I can't get over this Desert land? Desert world? Oh, that's themed pretty well, isn't it? Well, de I hate desert worlds. They all suck. I don't even I like Druid Valley. I love deserts. Well, Do you? Dude, it's fucking Sahasrala. You can read the language of the Hylia people. All right, thanks, dickwad. Wow. Wow. I'm gonna have some bombs. I'm gonna bomb this place. I'm gonna bomb you. I'm gonna bomb this place. I'm gonna bomb you. I'm gonna bomb this place. Give me some beer. Check it out. I'm gonna bomb. <laughs> oh yeah, you put that bomb in my ass. <laughs> put that bomb oh, in my ass. I want it to explode in my asshole. Oh, oh god. I love that bomb. Oh god. Oh, it's bombing it. God. I can't even stop. I'm 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 gone full retard. You know what I think it is about this game and, and about Ocarina of Time as well. They put a lot of shit in it for you to like do and find, and some of it's just like not explained. You just kind of stumble upon it. And I think like it, it's from like a like a more innocent age where you would like get a video game and you would like you you would like mull over it, you know? Yeah. You'd like play it for a long time because it's all you had. I mean, that's what it was with my with this game for me. That's how I, exactly how I feel actually about both Ocarina of Time and Banjo Kazooie. So like it's like you get like fucking Twilight Princess. It's like video gamers. <laughs> nice, nice going. Nice Thanks. Run. Thanks. Video <laughs> video gamers nowadays it's like they play a game and they just get it over with. So yeah, I feel no, like yeah, yeah. It's it's almost like when you're playing a game now. It's like oh, this is the whole experience. You know, you're just like going through a line. Yeah. Whereas this was like actually like you could find something in this and it would blow your mind after yeah. like you know. So you so like, uh oh, Hylia. Like dude, there were a lot of times where like I found like places that I'd never been to in Ocarina of Time. I'm trying to think of like one that I like never went to. Like I think, but like my point is, like in Twilight Princess and Skyward Sword and stuff, stuff's a little bit more laid out for you. So like you can just kind of get it over with, and you're like, oh, I'm done. It's like there's, there's not. not as much. Adventure. It's actually not. You th you don't think so? Twilight Princess has some really hidden shit. Like I went into like this mine thing that went on for like ever, and it was just like random. It was like in Lake Hylia. You just go into it. it it's n no. I would say for a lot of games, that looks like Xanth. I would say for a lot of games, yeah, but not not Twilight Princess and Skyward Sword. Well, Skyward Sword, yes, not Twilight Princess. Well, okay, just Skyward Sword then, just Skyward Sword. Yeah, and and even like, no, but you know, 
I don't know. Because there's, just... there's one thing about this game that I don't like about Ocarina, and is that... In this game, there's treasure in every temple. But it's not like so, it's it's not always something that you have to use in the boss. I don't see why that's a bad thing. I think it's just it's it's just formulaic and it kind of gets stale. Like you're you're like oh oh there's stuff in this temple that's, that looks like you need to use an arrow. Maybe I'll get an arrow. I like that. I, I think it makes it cool. That's preference. I, I just I think I think it makes it formulaic and, and predictable. Because it's like you're you're not like the boss isn't like a mystery. You're like oh shit there's a. In this, you're like, there's a boss at the end, I wonder what it's gonna that be. That doesn't really happen but as it, much as you say. It, it does! In Ocarina, it's every fucking level. Every level, you get a weapon, and then you use the weapon for the rest of the dungeon, and then you use the, the weapon to beat the boss. But that's not how it is in this game. In some of these- in some of the temples in here- Well, that's because these temples aren't anything at all. You, you don't even get a weapon them. sometimes. You get a fucking, like, armor or something. Or you get, like, something that helps you advance in another part of the game. But this game's more like an arcade game. The reason it doesn't have that stuff is because it just doesn't have that stuff. At all. You just run through with your sword slash and stuff, which isn't bad. But you do that in Ocarina. But it's more I mean more the, to it. The meta okay, is like, okay. killing dudes. In 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 Ocarina, you walk into the water temple, right? And you're like, dude, look at all these levels and like all the thought I have to put into it. This is just like your walk till you find it, get the key. That's not true. These are the first temp these are the first dungeons. Of course they're a little easier. Even the Deku tree had like cool stuff like that. Like you had to jump from the top of the Deku tree through the spider web. There's stuff like that in this too. There's a whole dungeon that's like interconnected. There's a whole dungeon that's interconnected, and you have to find all the different doors that go into the, the, the different parts of the temples. I found a door to my heart. Yeah. Shut your goddamn face. Shut your goddamn face. Put it, open up your heart, and say hello. Is that like, was that like Sonic the Hedgehog? <laughs> No, but I'm 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 very glad that you thought it was. Open your heart, it'll Dude. be alright. You know what's the best song ever? What's that? Fucking, what is it? Follow me, get me free. Just me and we will escape from the city. Like I'll make it through. Follow me. Did you play Sonic Generations? Um, I played it briefly. Surprisingly good game. Um, yeah, it was neat. No, like. Shit. It was just like all the best Sonic levels and a few of the worst ones. <laughs> Is that not like a fucking there's a treasure chest? Oh my god, I gotta go get that. I don't see that. I, uh... It's a you thing. But then there's a few things that okay, you know what? You're entitled to just liking something. You know what I mean? You don't have to justify it. There's some things you have to justify. Like overall, like game theory shit, but that's just something you like. I don't think I don't even think most people would agree with what you're saying, to be honest. <laughs> It, it it's a weird it's a really weirdly specific thing. Wait, get you have the bottle. I I don't. Oh really? I don't think so. I think it's. I think they'd agree with like a, a, what you're a, a lot good. How do you use the bottle? Oh, you have to use the, the net. The net, yeah. Right. Okay. How did you not know that? What? How did you not know that? What? What you just what just happened? The net. Yeah. Oh, cause I, the last game I played was Ocarina. Oh. So I was kind of I was like. Bottle, 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 what? Oh, oh. So if I go over here, there's the rocks. I can't do that. Can't I like how this half? dungeon is like half outside. That's how a lot of the dungeons are, actually. It reminds me of Splash Mountain. Really? Because that Splash Mountain, that's what I've always liked about it. I like going on an evening. Splash Mountain is a, is a Disneyland ride, if you don't know. It's... It's like, uh, you go, you're like, <laughs> Shut the fuck up. And then, <laughs> and then you, <laughs> Shut the fuck up. It's the, it's what it sounds like. <laughs> this. Show us your balls. And then, That's what I always thought he was saying. Show us your balls. Pretty good, show us your balls. You can hear anything you want in that, because you can really. How do you do? Yeah. Sucking on a wiener? Yeah. Yeah, it was, you always said sucking on a wiener. But, but. That's what you and say. Then you go outside. Oh, I got, still got. Canada Dry in my hair for my... I, I didn't even know you had Canada Dry in your hair. <laughs> well, it's not exactly the easiest thing to spot. But anyways, you go outside of Splash Mountain for parts of it, and it's just like, ooh, we're not in the ride, we're just kind of like outside. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, Remember, yeah. Oh my god, Splash Mountain broke down on us when we went. Oh, that's right. We walked out of the we ride. Walked, yeah, I, I actually wanted to steal a leaf. Yeah, I was kind of thinking of doing something like that, but then I thought like... It's still on eBay, man. Okay. I was thinking of doing something like that, but then I thought to myself, this is a place we cherish. 
And I'm sure that happens a lot if everybody still leaves. Be a leafless ride, man. No, they don't win. They just fucking order more leaves. Fuck Disney, them. they have a bazillion dollars. I'm just saying. There's... I felt like it was sacred. I couldn't t I touched the donkey, though. The donkey was like, oh, a fucking donkey. <laughs> <laughs> and I was like, I touched him on the way out. <laughs> He's just completely silent, and then when you walk by, he's like, oh, I'm a fucking donkey. He was just like, Mr. Donkey, thank you. We gotta start from groups. Oh, thank no, God. No, we don't have to start from groups. I had to start from Groom's house for a second. <laughs> oh, shit. Um, what I meant to say was, we'll see you. Okay, we're gonna continue this on the next... Game Grumps, Link to the Past. Okay, and I'm gonna show JonTron what he means You're gonna... to me. <laughs> See you guys. We're back. Hi, I'm playing Link to the Past, and JonTron. <laughs> Sorry. JonTron's coughing uncontrollably. That's pleasant. I, viewers love to hear that. What is that a heart? It's the Power Glove from Nintendo. <laughs> what if it was like? It's so bad. <laughs> you can feel the power in your hands. It's so bad. It's so be it. It makes you own all ninety of them. <laughs> All ninety of what? All he has he he owns all ninety of them. Ninety of what? It, Nintendo games. Do you remember that in the Wizard? He's Were like there the only ninety at that time. So bad. I have all ninety. And everyone's like, he's like, I have a lot of games. I own all ninety of them. Or something. Wait, 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 wait. And they're like all ninety games, mm. and he's like, yeah, they're so bad. <laughs> wait, <laughs> wait, hold on. When that movie came out, were there honestly only ninety Nintendo games? Like, I, don't, like, I don't fucking know. There's like a jack ton of them. I don't remember that line. <laughs> jack ton. Yeah, I always say jack ton. I'm sure. <laughs> oh shit, the wool you tiles. You say a hot minute. Say oh shit, the tiles are. Don't say hot minute. You say hot minute. <laughs> Shut your goddamn. You're like, I'll be there in a hot minute. <laughs> what is a hot minute? <laughs> you said it. Is that like? Is that like because if a minute gets like superheated, it becomes like faster? Wait a sec. Like the molecules move no, faster. No, I, re I remember why. PVG said that you were the only other person he ever heard use the term "hot minute." <clears throat> yeah. So why don't you know what it means? Does he use "hot minute"? Is that what he no, was saying? No, some other person he knows uses "hot minute." Well, I want to be the only person. Do you use the word "hot minute"? <laughs> Are you making me admit that I used the word hot minute? It's not really a thing you have to admit. It's not a bad thing. It's just an expression. Shit. You're getting fucking rapped. <laughs> Yo, listen up. This is linked to the past. Gonna go over here getting fucked in the ass. Got these things flying around. Gonna hit me with the tiles. Dude, Stolfos, Gibdos, Octoroks too. <laughs> You're the first member of the DK crew. <laughs> <laughs> DK Donkey Kong. Do you play that game? No. We should do that one too! We should- I don't know why I elbowed you. Those, we should collect- Those are all your favorite games. Yeah, we should collect every single one. I have all of them. I no, I mean them. the fucking bananas in the game. We should collect every banana? Yeah. Like, that'll be our mission? Yeah. Alright. We can even make the video like, banana one. Banana click two. That might get out of hand. That might get out of hand. How many bananas are there? Like 120 bananas? So we're gonna have 120 episodes? There's like 120 banana. bananas. Oh, no! What? I'm Mooney Bows! I'm at the Bows. Shit. I wonder if Susie thinks we're crazy. She already thinks we're crazy. Does she not care that we like scream? No. She probably does. <laughs> I love that girl. Anyway, nobody cares about me. I care about you. <laughs> they care about Link to the Past. Oh look, I died. You're so fucking bad. Look at this. Look at this. Alright, do you want to do it? Yeah. Alright, All right. I'm gonna start from Groom's house. Groom's house. No, you can't right. do that. You gotta start from the beginning. How do I start from the beginning? Okay, watch out. Push that block to the right. There you go. Oh, I got stabbed in the butt. Tender ass. Tender ass. You know, I'm glad I played this with you because I think this my sequelitis episode will be better as a result. Why? Because I'm really, like, I just, the, the episode is just fucking nuts. It's bananas. And I'm really trying not to come with a, what? I'm gonna make a dunk come. <laughs> go, go, keep going. I don't, I, I, like, I really don't want to approach sequelitis as, like, because I clearly like Link to the Past better, but, like, I don't want to approach sequelitis like that. I want to legit, like, analyze it and be like, look, no. this is what's different, and this the, is how it's different and what it does. I think we've already agreed in many aspects on what are the best and worst parts of Ocarina of Time, and I think we men uh, generally agree. I just don't want you to be like, 
Talk to time sucks, because it's not linked to the path. <laughs> I just don't want that. Yeah, but you know what? It's it's and I I need to really like pinpoint it when I watch the footage again because as I was playing this game and it, it might have just been nostalgic, but when I was playing this game, I'm like, all right, this is a straight shot. This is good. This is fun. There's things in this game that don't waste my time. And Ocarina, I got frustrated so much. Like there were so that many game, parts like, I got does frustrated. Does not frustrate with. me. It, 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 that interests me. Well, be, and I'm frustrated really easily by games. Like, really. Like, there's really so many easily. moments where I'm like, ah, why won't it? Ah, just fucking. Ah. Like, what? Just, like, bad jumps and. and okay, it's got and, a. It's, bad it, combat. It, it, it's and, got a lot of bad jumps. That It's a fault of it, but I don't. And, think. and like, things not being clear enough. It's, there's, a, there's one part in the Water Temple where, like, you're supposed to. You're supposed to know that, like. There's this symbol on something. But it's so dark that you can't see it, and I passed by wait, it like wait. seven times. You know what you need to do? Until I was like, "Oh, that's a thing that I was supposed do you, to do." Do you know what you should honestly do? What's that? Before making this episode, What's I'm that? not even kidding. What? Play the 3DS version. It's like the definitive version of the game. It, the, all those like kinks have been worked out. They made it clearer, like okay. visually. Like the water temple, they fixed it visually. Okay. Like there's yeah, what you're talking about, they fixed that. Like the. Like, the, you mean, like, the markings on, like, the water level? Yeah. They fixed it, they made it, like... Well, not even that, like, um... It was a block. It was a block that you had to, like, move. And I didn't realize, like, spatially where it was. Because the, like, little caverns are confusing. Oh. And, and so, like, I, I was just like, where the f how do I get in there? Like, what, what do I do? And I kept passing by it, and I, like, I didn't Fuck. realize that that was, like, the thing I had to move. Play the 3DS version, I'm telling you. Like, that's, that, or, you already played the... I played a little bit of it. You already, but I'm just saying you already like played the game. But like the 3DS version is the best version of the game. That's coming from someone who's like, my favorite. Game. Like, but but that's the thing. Like, see, with this game, like I'd play it again. Well, like I'm playing it again right now. Ocarina of Time, like I'd be hard pressed to play it again. Like I really, I, I didn't have a good time playing it. I, I was like I, excruciating. It's it's probably because it's like my literal like. Quit, well, uh, okay, Ocarina of Time is probably the reason that I do a show called John Trump. <laughs> like, so it's really important to me. But I can see how you wouldn't want to play it again if you just don't care about it. It's not like so I, many fucking. It's because you're just doing the swing attack, like you just attack him. It's like the most powerful attack. I think it does the same amount of damage. No, it doesn't. Because you can like hit him multiple times. This is so dumb. This is like way too hard. Get him right when they come out. Well, I just don't want to get hit. You're not gonna get hit. I if, will. If you attack them and they're coming towards you, then you'll get bounced back, and it's fine. You just want to be like. Game Up, down, left, or right from the hole Fuck! because they shoot their rocks diagonally. I didn't even notice they were shooting rocks. Yeah. I was like, why am I getting a hit? Oh, I'm dead. I'm dead. Okay. Just be right where their hole is. Do and they hit them when they do come they, out? Okay, they die one at a time like yeah. this. But when when there's one more left, he actually shoots rocks in every direction instead of just diagonally. Oh God, it pushed almost pushed me. Over. Oh, this is so hard! This is legitimately not easy! Fucking, I can't. This is so hard. Give it up, motherfucker, let me tell you a tale about a nigga named me gonna fucking. <laughs> about a nigga. Mochi opened the door! Mochi's a smart cat. Let me go close the door. Why, why are you doing that? Because why are you gonna seclude us from the rest of the world? No, I just wanted to be loud and annoy people. I know what you mean. People voluntarily watch us, and yet, the rest of the world that functions around us... I know, right? ...find us absolutely annoying. Isn't that the- isn't that the weird thing about it? it it's is. like, I'm like, like, to, like, yeah, the people around us are driven crazy, but I'm just like, there are people that actually care about this. Why don't you see this? My whole life is being loud and annoying, and you can't just warn me. I'm, of course... This is also something... This is something that Link to the Past does really well too. Is like when you die and you like need to fight a boss again. <laughs> Mochi sneezed. Sorry. And I, I actually, I actually can't remember too much about Ocarina. Like maybe it does it well too. But I remember being what? frustrated at one point that it didn't do it well. Do well. But um, so like you die and then you go back to the beginning of the temple, right? Yeah. But like there's in this they always send you back to a point where like you've opened up enough doors so that you can kind of make a straight shot for the boss chamber. Chamber. Yeah. But it's like still like a pain in the ass. So it's like, it's enough punishment, but it's not enough to be frustrating. Um, 
Ocarina, because because usually, there should be punishment for dying. Like. You don't usually die in Ocarina of Time. I do. Really? I don't. I don't want really to die when I play that game. Well, you're just too good at it, I guess. Yeah, probably. I guess. <laughs> like, like legit, you're probably too good at it. I. You know, you're probably right. Like almost all Zelda games, like I don't really die. I'm, the only times I die are like just like freak accidents, so like I fell off too many times from bad cameras. I didn't even get hit. You did a little bit. Don't I think worry. I got hit beforehand. No, you, you went in with full hearts. I did. Did I? And the rocks take half of your thing, so. Oh. I got hit by one rock. It's re you can win this game really fast. Yeah. Win this game. But there's still a lot to you, it. You win Ocarina See, that's what I like! In Ocarina, there's so many cutscenes and shit. I don't like that. There's so much like, you just got the pendant. Here's the- you talking to the gods now. He turned into a sage! Oh, thanks for turning me into a sage, buddy. That was real nice of you. As a sage, I'm gonna not influence you at all for the rest of the game. So... There's no reason for me to care, you to care about me. Wait, okay, what? bye. The sages? Yeah. They're totally people that matter. No, they're not. Yeah, they are, all of them. No, they're not. Every single one except the Temple of Time guy. No. What do you mean? I never cared. Whenever the fucking person turned into the Sage, I'm like, I don't I don't give a shit. You just don't like that game, then. It's not- It's boring. It should just be it's like, a I turned into a Sage. Thanks, Link, and it's, that's it. But they fucking drill shit into you. And this has been 11, and this has been seven episodes of Ocarina of Time's good. Link to the past is good. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wait. Next on Game Grumps. Who knows? Next time, we're gonna be grumpier. <laughs> we're gonna be even grumpier. Game grumpier. It, it went from, like, us laughing about Mountain Dew, which we didn't have any Mountain Dew at all, but... To, like, just being like... Ah, <sighs> <sighs> Alright, see you guys. Oh, God. Fucking ass... Ass and titties. What?! Ooh. Yes, please. Is that... Is that the groom account? I wish, see, I wish this yeah. uh, this emotion was yeah. just like cold. What? You know what I mean? Like, no. Not in the okay. Like the temperature. Let me. No, no. Okay. I wish that there was some way that we could just like present that emotion immediately to the audience. What do you mean? Because they see the icon and it's like, link to the past, you know. And it's not. It's, it's, it's like they already know her. that it's like, oh, this is what I'm getting into, and I then it's don't like know what you're talking about. Anyway. Group, it's a group. All right, we have a. Is that where we were? I, All right. I, <laughs> I guess we were on top of a fucking Mayan temple. I don't remember where we were. <laughs> <laughs> well, we have all that unreleased footage. Yeah, we have about an hour of us arguing over Ocarina of Time and Link to the Past from right when Game Grumps started. I'm gonna try to find that. I'm gonna try to bring it out for you all. I'll bring out the worst in you. That's something you do on a daily basis. Don't worry about it. I usually don't. <laughs> I just sit back and I'm like, <laughs> I enjoy what I've done. What? <laughs> I enjoy my work. What do you? Mean? I just see you like you're like, you're like ah, I fucking I, I hate blacks, and then <laughs> and then I'm like, I did that to John. <laughs> Except for the racism, I guess that is usually how that goes. Isn't it? Uh, well, what is it normally? I don't like cookies, and then I'm like, I don't know. It's usually just like I'm like. <laughs> That's the worst in you. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, uh, Link to the Past, we haven't played it for a long time! And I haven't- okay, I was saying, I have an unreleased hour of footage of me and Aaron debating Rock Hunter Time vs. Link to the Past, we never released it because Aaron was gonna <laughs> release Zelda sequelitis. I was gonna release it, you know, like we the next day. We were talking about making those side-by-side -side Zelda videos a fucking year ago in Palmdale! Yeah. A year ago. More than a year ago. No, I, I said I said I was gonna release Pogosm 2 before Magfest. How about that shit? How about that shit? I will say though, I'm very glad I didn't because the ending was terrible and I redid it completely. I will say can I talk? Yeah. I will can I talk? You mean talk about the fact that you've seen yeah. what is unseen yeah. by man yeah. as of right now? Yeah. Sure. It's looking pretty good. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> I think you'll all be excited to see it. I'm glad you think so. Yeah, I like it. I, I like the new version better than the old version. I will yeah. say the old version did not have the punch. It didn't have the didn't punch. didn't really have a punchline. I was trying too hard to be different from what I usually do. Yeah, I, I still think that this, this, yeah, this video is definitely, I'm just like, Aaron, what even the fuck are you? 
Like, what is this? <laughs> what even? Like, it's just, it's just not very, it's weird. <laughs> it's, <laughs> you're watching it, like, you're behind my back, and you're like, Aaron, what the fuck even? And I'm like, don't you like it? <laughs> like, we're fucking, what, is there something wrong with it? Spent, I thought it was fine. I spent years on this shit. Almost, Not even a joke! Almost completely a year. Not yeah. even a joke! Ladies and gentlemen, now for the real punchline, when's the new John Tron gonna come out of it, right? I wanna give a little update on John Tron. I was, I was, uh, I was gonna maybe say this in my, in, like, uh, I'm gonna put up a video on my channel talking about this. Uh huh. But I decided that I don't wanna do that. Oh, uh, why Because I'm that? scared of fan backlash. Well, that's just inevitable. <laughs> Regardless of what is created. You could create the cure to cancer and people would be like, you just wants to make money. That's not what I mean. I don't know, I just feel bad because I'm always like, this about John Tron and that about John Tron. People are like, yeah! And they're like, so what was that? where was that problem? <laughs> well, I don't do that because I have a curse. I'm literally cursed. Why? If I make an announcement... Did if you I make pick an... that up from the swamp? The Black Witch in the Swamp? From Macbeth? Oh, dude, you didn't tell me about that curse until just now? Is this shit contagious? No, 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 no. Oh, okay, good. Then I don't fucking care. Whatever, you're fucked. Oh. <laughs> okay, go on. What? I, I'm cursed. Whenever I announce something, it never comes out. Or it, not, it, it comes out way later. Yeah, you're cursed with the curse of everyone that ever does that. It's called setting up expectations for yourself and then fucking up and then going, eh. No, but me and... There's never been an announcement. I challenge you, fans, anything that I've ever said publicly, in a video, or at a panel, or at a con, or whatever, it is not true. Yeah, that's true. I remember, so I, I, I remember, like, saying I remember, like, there's, wasn't there one con where you're like, Metal Gear Solid, Metal Gear Awesome 3! Yep, Metal Gear Awesome 3 is next. That's why I, I think I said that at Infinite Bits. <laughs> that was years ago. I still implore you to make that. I actually... I think you're gonna... I actually had an idea for it. Oh, yes! I Oh my god, if I get to be here for the making of Metal Gear, can I just, I, I want to be like here while here you do it. While. I want to sit here while you do it. <laughs> I want to sit here, I want to be part of history. Okay. You're almost at a million subscribers now. Yeah, so is Game how Girls. crazy is that? My goal... John Tron's still lagging behind. Here. So nobody gives two shits. Oh my god, I'm totally... After talking about the curse, I was just about to declare something. Don't... <laughs> Declare anything. <laughs> just say, dude. Just be like Valve. Just like fucking like we're working on something. You'll see it. <laughs> well, it's not. It's not like a. It's not like I'm working on something sp specific. It's like. Specific. Rim. It's like um. That's, that's, that's coming out. Guillermo del Toro. He is. I. <laughs> <laughs> he is. Yes. <laughs> oh sorry. man, he's Go so on. del Toro. Um. What was I saying? <laughs> Something about, uh, oh, I thought you could go down a thing for that, but I didn't. I didn't go down a thing, That's I just came cool. back up. Um, I'm tr my goal this year is to stay ahead of Game Grumps and subs. Good luck with that. I know. <laughs> That's, <laughs> That's kind of how I feel, <laughs> which is I why. I want to wish you luck for that. I mean, I, I mean, I, I don't. Isn't it weird to be competing against yourself yeah. with yourself? <laughs> <laughs> it's like shit. Yeah, it's, it's really weird. Yeah, I'm just sitting there like fucking John Tron fucking like, passed up by Game Grumps. Cool. <laughs> <laughs> like, that's what... But I just I, I don't. Uh, it's it's just a motivation for me to keep animating because I've been in such a fucking slump, like nonstop yeah. slump. Yeah, yeah, dude. I mean, like, it's just, all right, all right, all right. For the are oh, you fucking idiot? I'm sorry. You're it's really not that bad. You're average at best. All right. <laughs> I did my best, Jesus, at least that, that was, was good. Fucking harsh. John, what the fuck? Are you even a person? Why did you say that to someone? Can you apologize even to me? Even if it was true, can you apologize to me? I can do a lot of things. Doesn't mean I'm gonna know. Doesn't mean I'm gonna know. Alright, alright, I just wanna say, alright. Uh -huh. Because I just wanna say, alright. Nice. No, you fucking like, just like, I'm just gonna push the play off, oh, jeez! <laughs> but that's what you're supposed to do. Uh, alright, oh, okay. <laughs> Um, I'm just kidding, you're not supposed to. Okay, well fuck you for lying. It was supposed uh, to... There's a little game design trick that was supposed to show you that you can fall down that. How them skulls do float? Uh... Some kind of gravity-related thing. float over the wall, but still, like, at the level of you? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> why wouldn't you... That's why wouldn't you do that? That's fucking fantastic. What that monkey wall! What's wrong? What that monkey wall! What's wrong with it? He's cute! Really? No. I thought he was kind of ugly. Well, just symbolic of 
general Amazon feel. All right, what I'm saying is, all right, I know it sounds like a cop out, and in a lot of ways it is. Uh -huh. But sometimes, as a creator, you, you well, if that's what you want to call us. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. What the fuck? Are <laughs> like saying we don't create I'm things? I'm sorry, I just don't like... I'm like Lil Wayne. I don't like labels. <laughs> I'm myself. I don't consider myself anything. You must get really confused at the supermarket. <laughs> <laughs> On that note, I don't know, as a content creator, especially like, like YouTube, you always want to keep like topping yourself. And so like sometimes sure. you don't want to just like make another video for the sake of making it and you get into this perpetual cycle of like I'll never be good enough. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. <laughs> and then like and then you kind of just like get in a rut and it happens and then people are like where's your fucking shit and you're like I'm sorry <laughs> and it gets you even deeper. Into yeah. <laughs> like you do you know do you get that? Yeah, absolutely. The problem with being an artist is it's such a like a cushy Yeah, it's a little cushy situation. So people who aren't artists can't relate to that like Idealism. Yeah, it's not like we punch in and it's like time to do the filing. Yeah. So, <laughs> so when I don't make a cartoon for six months, people are like, "What the fuck? I go to work every day. I hate it, but I do it." And it's like, I can't argue with that. <laughs> That's totally right. Yeah. You're right about that. I should be doing it, but I don't know. If there's you, you, you just I don't think can't. You can't force that kind of stuff. Yeah, you it's... can't force it. It's the problem. Because if you make a bunch of bad videos in a row, people are gonna stop watching. I'd rather make one really good video. Eh, it's locked! Yeah. I don't know, but oh, what I was gonna say is though, JonTron is coming back, baby. I can say this with certainty. Like, this isn't gonna curse him later. <laughs> like, just be patient, but JonTron will come back. Uh, I'm gonna try for two videos a month, but <laughs> don't count on that. Uh, I, I, at least one a month. That's uh, At least a, one a month, that's for sure. That is a statement I have oft made to myself and never to public. <laughs> uh, I'm just, I'm just, but we just want to give people a little update, because I haven't updated them in forever. Yeah. Like, but I, I, I've really thought about this, and I'm like, this is what I'm doing. For the foreseeable future, I can say probably for at least three months. You know, uh, I'm going to try this out, and uh, I'm going to go ahead and see if I can stick to that. I'm excited. I'm making a shitload of cartoons, so. I already have two finished. Yeah. Both me and you have just been like... I don't know, well, well, see, like, one thing that happened with us, I think, is both of us, we started Game Grumps, and then it, it looks like we're just doing this, but, like, there's a lot of stuff behind the scenes, and a lot of, just, there's a lot of stuff that goes on with Game Grumps that we have to be on top of at all times, and so, I don't know, we just sort of got a little sidetracked with it, but we're coming back to our... Senses. Not senses, but our routines. Well, we're, we're coming back to just the feeling of wanting to make more stuff, because that's what got us here in the first place. Sure. Do you agree? I don't want to speak for you. Yeah, well, I've always had that... Uh, well, I guess it's a specific feeling because I've always had the drive to make stuff, but it's just it, there's a different kind of drive involved as well. Yeah. What do you mean? Well, because it's like I want to make stuff, but you're like I can't. <laughs> yeah. Well, what do you mean? Ah, fuck! I died. Woo, 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 woo. What do you I mean? I believe I died in this. Yeah, dude. What's the what's the what's the what's the last thing that you heard? What the fuck are you doing over there? From Bill Cosby. <laughs> Wait, hold on. You were <laughs> talking about. Keep going. We can, this is special. You're a special. <laughs> I don't know if you mean that. A good way or a bad way. I was just making conversation because I was getting up and moving the chair because yeah, I, I couldn't see the time. Wait, yeah, I have it here. <laughs> yeah, but I want my time so I can write it down. <laughs> what? Because that's my job. It's fine. That's true. That guy's fine. to spit out a fire at you. Sorry. All right. No, but yeah. Well, we just. I don't know. What were you saying? Like you're like you can't. Yeah. Well, because. You said that it's just that we're getting our drive to make stuff back, and it's like, I've always had that drive, but there's a different drive involved in that as well. Like, what do you mean? There's not just the drive to make stuff, it's the drive to make stuff, and then the drive to... do it. <laughs> it's not so much the drive to do it, it's more so the drive to just be like, okay, yeah, yeah, I, I can make this, and this will be something that people will like. Yeah, well, it, it's focus, really, I Focus, guess. yeah, well, just, well, just, just that, it's more, I don't want to say inspiration, because that's not really the, the word. It's more so just like... I don't know, because most of the John, the videos on JonTron I made, they are made from, like, the bottom of my heart. Like, I was, that sounds stupid, but, like, I don't know, like, I was like, this is gonna be, I have this idea, and I don't want to do it. <laughs> like, and, you know, like, I did, and that's the reason that a lot of them, like, I don't know. Are good? <laughs> but, I like, can say it. You can just sit back and enjoy what I say about yourself. Right. well, thank you, Aaron. I appreciate it very much. Shit. I don't know, well that, uh, you know, like, I don't want to make something shitty and 
a lot of times you'll find yourself in a place like we're people too so sometimes we find our place in, in we find ourselves in a place where we're like, I just don't know how I'm gonna need to do this. Yeah. Like, and then like, you know, it really affects us and we have all these people looking to us to, to do it and it's like, I'm sorry, I wish I was better. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, welcome to artist self-loathing. <laughs> you know what I mean then. It's like, you could easily, and it's like, it's not easy. Yeah. <laughs> it's not easy to make fucking Metal Gear Awesome fucking phenomenon of the internet. It's not fucking easy to do that shit. We might get it. We might get lucky and like do it once, and then it's like, how do we do that again? <laughs> oh my god! Yeah, that's like the biggest fear of any artist. When people are like, he's clearly capable. Yeah. Make something else funny, and it's like, yeah. I don't know what I did. Yeah. <laughs> what did I do? That you like? I, don't know. I put on a weird hat and went. Bleh. You know what's analogous to that in like a gallonist in in like a, being a a draftsman, an artist, like somebody who draws. Yes. Is uh. Yes. Whenever I'm at cons, I have my signature. It's the little solid snake. Yeah. And I just know how to draw that. Yeah. The, all the cartoons I've, I've made. A million times. <laughs> so have I. <laughs> <laughs> Let's high five over life. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Um. <laughs> anyway, back to the it's a very straight conversation. Yeah. Um. I uh. So I draw that little snake, <laughs> but sometimes people are like, "Can you draw like this or whatever?" But. The way I make cartoons is I just make them and then I'm done. Yeah. I'm not like Disney where I had to like learn how to draw it and then like staple that shit in my brain. I just like made it and that's it and that <laughs> forever. So when somebody's like, can you draw the thing from the thing? I'm like, I don't know. <laughs> really? Yeah. You can't draw shit? No. I have to like make it up or like look it up on my phone. Are you fucking <laughs> Yeah. You couldn't draw Girl Chan right now? Uh, you? no. No. Are you shitting me? Oh, shit. I, I what might- What kind of artist are you? I might be able to draw Ken Star. <laughs> How can you not? Because you just- you just forget. Alright, I guess it's something I wouldn't know until I was there. Like, you just- you don't- you don't draw it in a long time, and then you're just like, How was it again? I guess that's true, huh? I don't know, I just th you'd think it'd be burned into your brain because you'd draw so many frames of it. Yeah, uh, it is for that period of time, but after that... Fuck, I gotta get that little skull bug out here. He's, he either falls or I hit him with a skull. Oh, hit him with a skull. I don't know, I just thought I'd get that out there because it's something that's been on my mind for a while. Just, you know, nobody wants to feel like it. It's weird, it's just weird because we make our own time. So, we're not on a, we don't have producers. And it's better off for it. <laughs> yeah. But just like, you know, like, I didn't die. Like, I didn't stop making JonTron. I just don't want to put anything on. Like, ah, it's weird. There are some YouTubers. Okay, wait, alright. I'll say this. Okay, alright, here, here, here's what I'll say. There's YouTube channels, like fucking Game Grumps is one of them. Fucking like, uh... This is actually one reason I really respect Smosh. Uh, because their stuff's all creative, it's not like a formula. And they do it just every goddamn week. Yeah, or like five second films. Yeah, like that kind of stuff. The creative stuff is what's hard. So... Like, yeah, like, like fucking like, uh... Kids react or something. You can do that shit till the cows come home. You just film kids reacting to shit and you put it together. Like it, that's like you know, it's like a job, like game games. <laughs> you just film it and then you put it there. But like with JonTron, I have to think really hard, <laughs> like about something that I want to do. Yeah. And like so, it's you not. You have to write it and produce it. You have to write it. So every episode is different. So I, I don't ha have a formula. If it did have a formula, you'd stop watching it. <laughs> yeah. Well. <laughs> People haven't stopped buying fucking modern games. Well, I don't want to make it that way, so... Yeah, I don't think anybody does. I, think, I don't think anybody with any inclination of the fact that they want to create something over make money for that something has yeah. that thought. <laughs> yeah, like, I, I don't care about money. But, like, I, I care about having enough to not starve. God damn it, Aaron. I'm a shitty Zelda. You are. But I, I don't know, I just want to say, I do care. I, like, I just, you know, John Tron's not dead, I do care. And... Let's get a little real. You like real? <laughs> Nobody knows that you're jacking your peen but me. Oh, God damn it. Maybe this time Aaron won't suck so bad. Maybe this time I actually beat the fucking temple. Instead of dying twice. <sighs> 
What temple is this even? How'd you get it's, here? It's the first dark temple. I don't know. It, it probably has a name. I just don't know it. It's the first dark temple? The for forest temple, I think. Why would you fucking do that? Why would you say that about me? See, that's why this game... <laughs> Should I just not go there? <laughs> Should I just not go there? That's why this game isn't as good as Ocarina. <laughs> ah! <laughs> no, I mean just all the temples. Is, I mean, I, I get it. They just kind of, but it's a SNES game. So. <laughs> you can go ahead and not like that all you want. I don't know. I just I always thought it was kind of bland looking. Like all the temples look the same. They don't really. They all have their own uniqueness to them. They only have their own like. The only difference is like the faces on the walls are different. Um, no, there's a lot of differences in a lot of the temples. Like what? Yeah. The but, ground might be a little different, I guess, but it all looks at it kind of like... But specifically, it's that it, it it's more gamey, their differences. It's more what? Gamey. Like, each temple is like, oh, that's the temple that has the this. No, yeah, I mean, I get that. I'm just talking about it in looks. Because I care about looks. Yeah. Looks are all that matter to me, Aaron! I think we had a conversation a while ago. Did we? Probably yeah. Probably gonna have a lot of conversations over again where, right now. <laughs> where we had the, um... Da -da -da -da. Was that Mjolnir? I don't remember. Yes, it is. Magic hammer? What is that? I don't remember that item. Uh, you can. It's like the Megaton hammer. Uh -huh. You can pound things into the ground. Can you use it as a weapon? Yep. You can have you use to. it as a grappling? Um, I don't know what that means, but we can look it up on Google if you want. Google Docs. Hello. <laughs> is that the voice of Google Docs? <laughs> yeah. Just you? <laughs> don't die. Don't die. I'm not gonna die. You're gonna die. Oh, come on. Give me a little. Do you have any sort of health potion? No. God damn it. I haven't a single possible. Look into the mirror and see if you can, like, will yourself so <laughs> You're beautiful. You're good, you're good. Daddy didn't know. Daddy was wrong. <laughs> Is that you speaking from experience? Um, maybe. maybe you, don't have, you don't have to probe that deep, okay? Some things are better left dead! What were we having? Oh, right, right, right. We were having a conversation <laughs> about like, oh, that. <laughs> We were having a conversation about, um, the visuals. <laughs> the gays in Virginia? That oh. you value the visuals more. Uh, well, not, not like, com not, I'm not like, I still always prefer a good game. Sure. What was it we were talking about, though? It was a specific game. Where uh, I was like, I don't like that. <laughs> They're like, whoa! <laughs> they raised their arm. I think it was, I think it was like a... <laughs> You're just sorry, you just like almost stepped off the edge, I imagine Link's like, whoa, that was fucking close. <laughs> I think it was, um... I think it was a modern game. We were talking about modern games. Oh, that's right, we were having the immersion conversation. Yes. And we basically declared that, because uh, you use like Skyrim as, as Ooh, an example. The Oculus is coming soon. As an immersive game. I want to play Oculus Skyrim. <laughs> I want to play Oculus Skyrim. If they fucking make it to support it. I mean, all the games will eventually support it. Are you kidding me? Well, we'll see. I don't, already a thing I don't want to get my hopes too up. I'm going to get them as up as they need to be. <laughs> because... Well, if you don't get them up, then when it, it, sh it shows up, you're like, Oh my god! And if you get them up and it doesn't show up, you're like, Fuck the Oculus. <laughs> I guess. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck it, bro. I can't believe I even liked it. So much potential and I don't even get it. <laughs> Stupid. Dude, these guys are way too happy for... Oh, that's what you use for, like, whack a mole -ing? Yeah. Oh, wait, wait, what were you saying? What game? Skyrim? Yeah, um... Skyrim's great. You were just talking about how it was an immersive experience, and I was like, ah, uh, whatever, you just walk around. It's pretty much the same as any other game. It's very it's immersive it's, game. It's the same as Fallout, it's the same as... Not the same as... That game is, is in a league of its own in Skyrim, it's so good. Well, my point was that... You're... I get immersed in a game like Tetris, where everything around me just disappears, and I'm completely engrossed in that experience. It's a different kind of immersion. If I'm, if I'm, I, I never found myself engrossed in a game like Skyrim or Fallout or something because it's, it's, it's so like there's text boxes and this and that isn't like I don't know the the world access of it doesn't it's like whatever it's interesting but it's not immersive to me. It's a different kind of immersion. I just don't. To me, that type of immersion that you're talking about doesn't exist. Maybe it exists for someone else. And I, you know, that's totally valid, I guess, but... I think it does exist. I don't know why you would say it doesn't exist. I've never experienced it. Well, that's... most. I think most people have. It's like, so, Half-Life 2 is an immersive game. So they say. Like, why, why would so many people say it if, they, if it was not a thing? Um, oh, that's a large... That is a large animal that you have walked into the room of. Did you wreck it? 
<laughs> Did you break it? Ah! He's opened his little mouth and throwing a little ball at you. Oh, his, his purple shell? That's true. Well, <laughs> I was gonna follow it up with a statement. <laughs> but I guess if you agree already... <laughs> Oh, Why ruin that moment? Wait, it's purple shell what? I don't know. You're gonna look goofy. No way. It's easy. Easy? Yeah. Push it out. Oh my god, I'm just a little engrossed. <laughs> oh man, that was like... Ah! <laughs> 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 this is terrifying! Yeah. You beat it? Yeah, man. Wow, nice! <laughs> Holy crap! Holy crap! It's not that hard. You, you aced it! No! If you walk into the that hard. spikes. If I aced like the, the two headed one at the end of the game, I'd, I would have been impressed. But... That doesn't even fill your hearts up. Oh, it does later. It does? At the, at the end, oh. when you talk to the princess, he just does a little sword thing. He's like, uh -oh. he's like, whoosh, whoosh, and then like, it all falls oh, yeah. up. I know what you're talking about. I love that, like, whoosh. Yeah, me too. Yeah. Like old SNES yeah. fucking sound effects. Group, because, because of you, I could escape from the clutches of evil monsters. Thank you! Huh? What are you talking about, Aaron? I mean, go ahead and narrate some more. This world is no, go ahead. What are you doing? Just say the words again. This world is the vulture. Ew, is, why are you holding your hand here? Because <laughs> again, yeah, the, the boss of Eve was the one who transformed. Are you trying to make it sound creepy? <laughs> it's like a fucking Satan voice. All right, let's try, let's try, let's try, let's try. Let's try. <laughs> like, I'm, I'm sure, sure he's, he's intending, intending to conquer, conquer evil. Even our light world after his power, power here. here. Something like that. Yeah. Does that sound any good? Yeah. <laughs> that just sounds stupid as fuck. Yeah, let's try it again without me fucking right. losing my breath. Okay. Right. He is trying to open a larger gate between worlds near the castle using our powers. Does that sound cool? I don't know. I guess we'll find out. Yeah. On the next episode. Not yet, probably. <laughs> Not yet, probably. <laughs> We'll oh. find out on the next episode. No, no, we'll find out after they're all done. Skyrim's awesome. I, I don't disagree. I've never had a, a game where I just like walking around and I'm just like, what's gonna happen to me? Like it feels <laughs> like that. It's awesome. Some guy comes up to you and he's like, hold this for me, and you're like, what? And then a guy comes up behind him and he's like, did you see a guy? <laughs> I guess okay. I, I guess my my point about the immersion thing is eh. that. When we were talking about how you value visuals more than I do... Yeah, dude. That's um, why I like boobies. Well, boobies I like all boobies. day, all night, boobies all day. That's a different conversation entirely. Is it? Because I think it's the same fucking conversation, just disguised, and you're just trying to make it not about that. I'm not that clever. Okay. <laughs> well, I can agree with that. <laughs> Alright, what were you saying? Um... Is that... Modern I'm games don't... <laughs> don't... Don't give me that much credit. <laughs> Uh, modern games, I feel like, aren't as immersive as a game that's really well designed. You know, you play a game of chess, it's very immersive. That's a different kind of immersion. You're talking about I don't, two different I, things. I don't think so. You're though. talking about flow versus immersion. You're I seriously? don't. No, 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 no. That's not true at all. I don't think that at all. Well, that you're, this immersion is different. Okay, you're enveloped in an experience. That yes, entirely. I'm, that's not what people are referring to. But that's life. What? That's life. Being enveloped in an no, experience is life. No, you can be pretty life. damn third person about yourself if you're like me. If you, I mean, if you walk to like the Grand Canyon, you're like, wow, this is big. It's an experience that you're immersed in. Yeah. That's an experience. You can also turn to your you friend can have and be a... like, hello, I'm still here at the Grand Canyon with you. But you're there. So, you're there too, and you're playing Skyrim. But it's a game. That game does not break its rules. Like, okay, if a game is like Skyrim, and it doesn't, and like the world is very fleshed out, and everything within the world like makes sense within the world, and it's kind of real, and it feels real, that's what people mean when they say immersive. Like Half-Life 2 or something. An immersive game, like Bioshock Infinite. It's an immersive game. It immerses you in the world and it never breaks character. Whenever it's immersive. Whenever I just don't agree with that. <laughs> How can you not agree with a thing? Because the fact. Because the experience isn't as immersive. It's very like. It's, it's very like plotted. Can you we see just what I'm play saying? Strider two and yell at weird <laughs> at seals, please. <laughs> But do you I've had quite enough of this. I'm like a fucking, like, I'm like an old married couple. I'm just sitting here like, yeah, Janet, shut up, Janet! We're going to the market tomorrow, Janet! <laughs> I don't feel that way. Because <laughs> I don't think... I'm very feminine right now. Next time on Game Grumps! What? Name of Aaron not getting stuff! Except when he gets me gifts from Harry Potter World. He got me a one, and it's good. Hey, welcome to... Uh, that kid's over there. Just chill out.
to chill, 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 chill now. In the corner. Who's that cat? Who's that? Who's cat is that? You have to welcome people before they start talking about fucking cats. Why can't I talk about cats on my own fucking show, because Aaron? Because our show's not called Cat Grumps. Well, it could be. It could be called fucking Anus Langers. Do you want to make that decision right now? Yeah. Because I've always been thinking about All it. Alright, let's start over. Meow, meow, meow. This is a very creative theme song, given the fact that the subject matter was cats. Welcome to Cat Grumps, I'm a cat, and so is this guy. His name's not John, and I'm not Aaron, we're just cats, and we haven't been named yet. <laughs> we're just cats, man. I feel like I had a story to tell on this show, like so, I feel this, like I had a place to go in this some, game. There it is. <laughs> oh my god, okay. there's so much more. Wait, was there something that happened to us recently that, like, was show-worthy? Uh, your Ikea thing. Are you serious? Yeah. What Ikea thing? The truck? <laughs> oh, yeah! I still haven't even heard that story. Oh my god! I ordered two Billy Bookshelves from Ikea because I was running out of space for my games. Because, you know, I like collect retro games or whatever. And I was running out of space, so I ordered two more, and I had them delivered, right? Okay. The guy at Ikea was really fucking mean to me, too, when I was ordering them. He was like, he was like, I got really mad. Because... <laughs> Well, uh, you know how when you go to Ikea, you can have them, like, and deliver it? Yeah, yeah. Because I just didn't know where they were, and we were in a rush. So I was like, it was like an extra 20 bucks or something to just have them take it for me. Like, I, they would do everything, I just had to give the papers. Yeah. So I was like, alright, picking and delivery, like, sure. Uh, I was just like, do, do the whole do the whole thing for me. And then I go up to the guy and give him the paper, and he, like, fucking, like, he's being all slow and fucking, like, angsty teenager worker-y. And yeah, like, like, I don't want to be here. Yeah, better like, he's than like, this. you're gonna fill this form out. I'm like, alright, he's being whatever. And then, and then, like, fucking. And then he just goes, like, he looks at the paper and he's like, you're gonna pay us to look for you? And I was like, yeah. <laughs> he's like, they're not even that heavy. And I'm like, I don't care. <laughs> I know. <laughs> I hate when fucking people like that give you sass. Yeah. <laughs> It's like, fuck you! I have I have money. I want to give you it. I know to perform the service that you were hired to do. Yeah, I know. It's like I'm like, did I did I say it was heavy? I just want you to get it for me. Like I don't even want to. I'm not even trying to be like a spoiled ass like. Why did I do it? I mean, I'm just like it was just like, dude, what the, are you implying I'm a weakling or like? <laughs> what are you like? What are you trying to make me feel bad about? You offer the service. Like, I don't know, it was just really bizarre. And then, like, <laughs> so anyways, that happened. The next day, the delivery truck, okay, <laughs> I'm in my room, right? And I'm just chilling. And then I just suddenly hear, <laughs> like, all my power goes out. <laughs> Did you hear about this? No, yeah, I, I heard, like, the, the summary of the story. All my power goes out, and I'm like, oh, yeah? <laughs> so, I was thinking about it for a while, and I thought maybe the power just went out, and then I'm like, no, I think something happened, and I was like, my IKEA bookshelf should like be here by now. The guy said he was gonna be here in ten minutes, and then like, I go up to my balcony and I look over, and there's a giant truck crashing into my building, <laughs> and, and I just was like, what? and I was like, huh? And I call the IKEA guy, and I'm like. Did you just crash into my building and cut my power? And he's like, oh, it wasn't me, it was my brother. <laughs> <laughs> I'm serious! I love that deliberation. <laughs> like, oh, all right, see ya. <laughs> <laughs> well, <coughs> whoa, what the fuck? <laughs> whoa, whoa. Okay there, buddy. Why did I start Enjoying bumping? your story a little too no, much. No, it's just hot here. <laughs> <laughs> no, it wasn't me. It was my brother. Dude, he kept saying it's like, it. That's the answer, though. No. Yes. <laughs> no, he, he kept saying it, dude. I just feel like everybody in fucking IKEA just got some sort of excuse. <laughs> but I don't know. I just was like, he he just he came upstairs and he's like he's like what a day. <laughs> he like fucking puts the the bookshelves down and he's like the brakes just failed. My brother crashed. And I'm like, we gotta get it, dude. You gonna throw your brother under the bus or should I say the IKEA truck? Ha! What an asshole. He was a nice guy. I told him to go kiss his kids goodnight because he almost died. Like apparently he went like like one of those like extreme electric explosions. Yeah, those are cool. Yeah, like I I saw it. Like my like it was like it was like some sort of like light that happened from outside my window and like in the day I was like, something just happened, didn't it? <laughs> 
Yeah. Something something that would have made it day for a sec if it was night. Yeah. Oh yeah, it would have definitely. I okay. s what? Go ahead. <laughs> I thought it was a pretty good story. I got I I got bookshelves out of it. <laughs> you got bookshelves yeah. as, as reparation for your. We were just there and we were like. Oh, How long was your power out? Uh, actually, not that long. Like half an hour. Oh. Well, we were putting nice. the bookshelves together and putting stuff away, and it was kind of fun. It was like I kind I was upset when the power came back on. Because <laughs> you know when the power goes out, and you're like, now we have to be like cavemen. Yeah. And you're like, let's put a bookshelf together. The power comes back on. It's like, god damn it! Now we can play Fallout 3 again. <laughs> this is the this is the worst option. Now my feeling that I'm addicted to video games and internet is back. I actually and I'm unhappy with my life in I, general. I sometimes like it when I don't have the choice to do things. Yeah. Yeah, totally. It's a it's a fucking rock. This is fucking rock. You, know, you just like happen to be on a. Yeah. What if you teleported the into that? There's one rock here! Yeah, that is true! You have the one rock! Yeah, use it to kill that crab. It is hot in here, Aaron. Oh, uh, sorry, I'll turn the air on. That would be great. Also, I. <laughs> Hold on. Are you glad that I turned the air on? <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Oh, oh God. <laughs> For those, those oh, of you at home, no, it didn't who want to know? Who want to know my brilliance? It didn't happen. Did it really happen? I I turned myself. Yes, you did. And then you turned yourself into even more of a. Aaron fucking turned to me slowly. I thought you were gonna tell me something. Like it's, I thought you were gonna be like, I just remembered my mom is corpses in the basement. Like <laughs> you gave me that fucking look of like, oh no. <laughs> And then you said that beautiful line, because you, because you turned and your name's Aaron. Did you really think that it was beautiful? No. What are these fucking Bowser ass motherfuckers? Uh, those are Zoras. These are Zoras? Mm -hmm. They're evil. Yeah, they're jerks. They're not evil in any game except this one. Spit shit at you. They're evil in every game. No, they're not. Well, the Ocarina made them good, but everything before this. Well, maybe Zoras were invented in this. Shit. Were Zoras? I think so. Only Octoroks were. Ha ha ha! What do you want, little man? You have something to ask me? I want the flippers. No, it's 500 rupees! <laughs> okay! I love how back then, all these games, like, ah. the enemies are just like so generic looking. Fish man with fish flippers on him. Looks like a merman from like Castlevania or something. Yeah. It's a bit generic. It is cool. That is something I like about Ocarina is that. I think we had this conversation too. What? Uh, that the, all the creatures are like original. Yeah, I love that. The, the, there's just races, and you're like, oh, the Gorons. And you just totally get it right away. It's like you walk into the Rock City, and there's Gorons, and you're like, oh, they're rock people. Yeah, I, I, I love the character design in Ocarina of Time. You know what I love about Ocarina of Time? But I don't know, that it, you like it so it's much? It's still my favorite game. I'd say that, that in Majora's Mask. Majora's Mask is pretty cool. We gotta play on the show some point. Alright, fine. We've been holding off on that. Because we like that was the game that was like, we'll wait, we'll wait for Majora's Mask. Or Ocarina, one of the two. Dude, uh, you, you know Oh, we should just play Ocarina and I see how fast I could speedrun it. <laughs> it's not. Just don't. Why? Because it's it, it every time that happens, it's like, oh whoops, I don't remember as much as I thought no, I did. No, I do with that one. You, you say that now. No, I do with that you one. You say that now. I do Oops. with that one. If, you, if you're if you gonna go ahead and make me feel bad about myself for a thing that's good, then... Oh, look, I'm not... Hot. I'm not trying to... Ooh. Uh, Ooh. To tell the truth, it is. What? Wait. What? It's, just, what it's the, the Great Fairy Fountain. What, what did she just give you? She gave me back my bow because I threw it in her stinky, smelly pond. Why did pond. you throw it in there? Because I fucking... I wanted to get her attention because I just wanted to see her boobies. <laughs> you, just, you just go up to a fucking pond, <laughs> throw in your fucking bow and arrow. She just comes out like, fuck, dude! She comes out like, what the fuck? Whoa! It's dirty! <laughs> That's dangerous. Not really. You could have nicked me, though. She upgraded my boomer. So now I have a magical did sparkly she, boomer. <laughs> Ross is the other day. And I was like, I had like a sore throat or something. And he, he, he asked me if I wanted a cough drop. But in Auss Aussie speak, so he called it a soother. <laughs> we He's thought never it said that one to me. We say, he was like, do you want a soother, John? We all thought it sounded like some sort of blowjob technique. <laughs> <laughs> it was pretty funny. You want a soother? You want a soother? Ross, Ross has... Almost eliminated his Australian accent. I don't know why he would aim to do that because it's beautiful. It's it's not something that you do consciously. You just you talk to so many people after a while, 
and you, and <laughs> that you, you just, just get bored of everyone. And you just hear the words that they say, and you say them like them. Next time on Game Grumps! Get to the next temple already. Quit getting red, what the fuck cares? What does it even do? Alright. Wait, you gotta turn the arrow. I'm serious. <laughs> My biggest question to you, where are we going? To the next temple? Is it two? Yeah, it's two. It's the water temple. See, how was that the forest temple? There was only forests like about it, except uh, it was... that it had a monkey face on it, and they don't even live in the forest, they live in the jungle. It was the outside that was the forest temple. What? The outside was part of the temple. The outside? Yeah, what's cool about this game is that each temple's unique in that it, like, integrates the world outside of it as well. So, like, that one had the forest maze, and then you have to get through the forest maze to get into the dungeon. Oh. Uh, this second one, the water temple, um, you have to get the flippers, first of all, because there's a lot of swimming in it. But, um, when you come down here, I'm, like, right at the entrance. It's, like, right here. Uh, one screen over. There we go. Um, so this is, like, the entrance to it, right? Yeah. So you go in... I think I've really done this. And you're like, oh shit, I can't get up there. The fucking ladder's too so short. So you have to get the water, right? And you're like, oh, there's all these like water vents and shit. Uh, Sahasrala gives you a little hint. Oh, right, Sahasrala. Um, so you go out and you're like, hmm. And you go to the fucking light world. And you go inside here and there's like a gate that, that uh, opens up the water ways. That's right. I've done this, actually. And then once the waterways go up, you go to the dark world, and there's water in the water temple. I don't know why I'm, like, I'm the only person in the world that doesn't game very much. Uh, I mean, you're fucking human. <laughs> what do you mean? You're allowed to, like, dislike Well, things. no, but it's weird, because I like every other Zelda. I, I particularly like this one. And even this one, like, it's got its problems. Like, look at that, he's not even breathing correctly. That's one of the biggest problems I have with this game. You're right. He doesn't know how to do a correct breaststroke. Yeah, you know what they should have just done I've in this game? I've quite a few breaststrokes in my day, if you catch my friend. I can't, it's water. <laughs> like, <laughs> continental drift? <laughs> Wait, that's nothing to do with water, that's plate tectonic. Who the heck do I think I am, you know what I'm saying? Come over here trying to talk science to you, what do you think I am? Sixth grade Mr. Mullinson? Was that your sixth grade teacher? I don't remember his name. But Mr. Mullins. I think his name might have been, might have been Mr. M I probably should. Can we Google it. Mr. Mullins? It's not. That's not. Was my teacher? <laughs> Who was? Well, I don't want to say on the show and jeopardize this. Well, why don't you give a fake name and then defeat the? I've actually I've accidentally that. done that before. What? I mentioned a teacher and then shit went crazy. Really? Yeah. You're like I'm, messaging I'm, him and I'm shit. drums? It's like on a live stream. Oh. So I've learned my lesson. I don't mention people from my real life anymore. <laughs> Unless it's somebody that's clearly in the public eye. I yeah. don't, they're not, they're not. I don't mention them. Except for Ross, fuck that guy. Yeah, fuck Ross. <laughs> <laughs> we can talk about him all we want. What an idiot, he thinks he's from Australia or something. He does! <laughs> he's utterly convinced! <laughs> like, not even just, he doesn't even just, like, he has no humility about it at all. He's like, I'm from Australia! I know, and the really fucked up thing about it is Brisbane. that- it, The really fucked up thing that it, about it is that he is. Sydney! Wallaby! Is that- <laughs> Pirate spider! What? Magnetic frog whisker! Right, now you're just getting into the realm of impossibility. <laughs> Although that does backwards sound- Backwards driving! It does sound like a good idea, but <laughs> backwards driving. <laughs> like, everybody from Australia comes here and they're like, Oh my god, it's so much better! <laughs> Kookaburra goes in the golden drop tree! This makes so much sense -I -S -S -I now! K-I-S-S-I-N-G! That's not part of the song. Is it not? No. I was under the impression that it was. Why would you think that? Well... That's another song. I think it's just part of my general ignorance and my, my unwillingness to learn past the age of 20. What was the last thing you learned when you were 20? Don't listen to anyone with good advice. <laughs> How's that working out for you, John? Not very good! <laughs> 
What was, well, that was a good thought, I think. Mm, pull that guy's dick a little. Uh, you can. Pull his dick a while. You can. Uh, no, not those ones. I think, oh, that's the big chest. Yeah, dude. <gasps> you gotta, you got you gotta start getting a little more creative because I saw that one coming a million miles away. <laughs> Did not see that one coming a million miles away. <laughs> <laughs> How'd that work out for you? Uh, Devin? Can I have another? Ooh. <laughs> Ooh, is it musky? This is, this is rancid. Is it m <laughs> Hey, this is rancid! <laughs> I'm not- ah! <laughs> <laughs> No! I can't even smell it. I don't even know what you're talking about. So okay, hold on. I can't. No? No. I've never been so off put by my own fart before. I've never ever what? in my life been off put by my own fart. I've never. This... I love the smell of my own farts. Me too. They're hilarious. <laughs> like the smell is funny. Yeah. And and I I like I have that impulse where I feel bad for the people around me, but at the same time, like inside, I'm like, yeah. <laughs> I don't know. I'm not, I, that's the first time I've ever been off put by my own. What the fuck? What? I just usually your farts smell good to you. Is that no? I've I've heard a lot of people talk about that. Yeah, but is that like a like a universal constant? I think so. That that it's like, oh yes. And if you smell someone else's fart, you're like. <laughs> yeah. I, I, I. What if? Okay. Here's something. Isn't that weird? It's kind of gross. No, no. What if? What if it's like psychosemantic, right? So, you fucking, you fart and your fart doesn't smell, but somebody else secretly farts. And then you smell their fart. Will you like the smell of it? I'm sorry. Can you can you repeat that scenario? So time? I got lost in your eyes. You and somebody else fart at the same time. Okay, go on. Yours doesn't smell, but the others does, and you don't know that they farted. Will you like the smell of that fart? Huh. We should try this in some double blind studies. <laughs> That is that that is that is something like I don't who the fuck would do like we've uh, we've take, uh, taken together the best scientists to find mm -hmm. out if people really like the smell of their own fart. We're clearly underestimating NASA. I fund them. What do you think they've been doing for the past twenty years? <laughs> they need you think to... they've been launching spaceships or something? <laughs> no. You think they've been traveling the stars? No, no, These actually. Just want to know about it's, fart science. Stars are really far away. Fart science! <laughs> you look a crap in the, the fart science, Barry. <laughs> if you don't do something for that, Barry, I will be just I'll fire. <laughs> you will fire him. Is that okay with you? I didn't discuss this with you. <laughs> I mean, you know, I usually trust your judgment, so. <laughs> just from now on, Barry, do that or you're fired. <laughs> That's such like a cartoon thing. I know. But. <laughs> dude, this but what? Or you're fired. But what, Aaron? But. I don't know. Yeah, I always thought he was like kind of like swallowing. Like. Like he's got water in his mouth. Barry, I'm sorry, I would never fire you. Unless you embezzled from the company. <laughs> so don't do that. Or like sleep with my girlfriend or something. Don't do those things. That'll get you fired. Would you like okay? Would you? If you had like a, like a fucking like long term girlfriend for like three years, yes. and then Barry, would you really like be like you're fired, or would you be like, dude Barry, how could you fucking do this? Barry, how could you fucking do this to me? I just love that. That's the first thing. If you do, if you do that, you're fired. <laughs> It's like, oh. Yeah, it's so true. That's it? Wouldn't, wouldn't I first be like, We're wait, still cool? Yeah, wouldn't, wouldn't, it, wouldn't it just the first thing just be like, What, what, what prompted you to do that? <laughs> what? what? Do you know how much I fucking love her. <laughs> I love her. I love her. What did you do that? <laughs> Alright, next time on Game Grumps, Barry gonna... sleeps with our girlfriends? <sighs> I hope so. <laughs> wait, I hold know. on. What? I know. So. Oh, jeez! <laughs> I put a clip of it. Uh, don't you forget about me. 
know what's funny is you go back to the fence mm -hmm. and then you, is that fun? You open is that up. Funny? Yeah. <laughs> it's funny that I do it. Okay. I'm not. The episodes aren't funny. Oh. Okay. But anyway, it, you, we start the episode and it's like, welcome back to Game Grumps. John was just. We, we, I I'm in the the process of completing the second water temple. The. <laughs> What? <laughs> That's how they were. Yeah. It's like, well, if if it was if it was like a first episode of Game Grumps, like like, if we open this episode, it would be like, welcome back to Game Grumps. Right now, I think I'm gonna defeat the Water Towers. You mean back in the day? Yeah. I also noticed that we were more jovial in general. Well, that's just because we were. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> We've become bitter old souls now. Have we? A little bit. No. Yeah. Well, we gotta evolve with the times. The, the times Get, of getting worse, bitter and old. Bitter getting worse. No, I don't know. It, it, no, it's 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 not. It's not that we got like bitter. It's just like at, at first we didn't really know each other as well. I think we talked about this, haven't we? We didn't really know each other as well, so it was just kind of like it was just kind of like. Oh, look at that. <laughs> oh yeah, we were like trying to offend each other. Yeah, we really were, and it was like. <laughs> and now it's just like, eh, fuck off. It's just, it's just like it's just like marriage at this point. <laughs> Is well, it's, I mean, we signed the papers. <laughs> we it's did. It's pretty much official. We really did. I don't know. It's funny. It's nice though, because it's always like at the end of the day, it's like, but he's got my back until I stop making you money. <laughs> <laughs> and then he's, he'll just take my back and, and never <laughs> give it back. He'll take it back as he'll take my back as collateral. <laughs> <laughs> so he will always have my back, but. I won't have it. It'll think, just be his. I think my favorite game grumps are just the ones where I'm not sure if I'm crossing the line. <laughs> I'm like, is Aaron gonna be like, dude, stop. <laughs> Don't talk about that. That's when the game pauses and I look at you silently. <laughs> is it? <laughs> yeah. What do you mean? And then you look over at me and I'm looking at you and you're like, oh no. <laughs> Does that happen? <laughs> yeah, it's like once or twice, maybe. <laughs> I don't know. I, <laughs> I just love how sometimes. You'll just, we'll just be talking after a grumps, I'll just be like, I said something really racist, and you're like, oh, just don't even say those things. <laughs> well, it's not, that, uh, that's giving the wrong impression. I, uh, you're, I don't care. <laughs> it's you the one who cares. You, you say them, and then you, like, regret it, and then you just kind of have a bad day for the rest of the day. <laughs> and I'm like, why do you do that to yourself? <laughs> We should probably cut this. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Is it happening now? Is it happening now? Is it happening now? <laughs> I don't know. Is it too much behind the scenes? <laughs> What what is this that's behind the scenes? I'm sitting on a couch with you. I have a Super Nintendo controller in my hand, and there's a computer recording everything. I don't know. I just don't want people. I, I want to make people happy. My favorite thing is to make people happy who are sad. Otherwise, those are my favorite emails to get. You make me happy by just Thank you. being here. <sighs> oh. Are you okay? Yeah. It's just, Jesus Christ. I had an extreme itch. I'm sorry. Oh my God. Wait, have you? You ever get those emails where they're like, I'm, like, when people are like, you know, I look forward to going home every day and watch your game crumbs. Yeah. And I'm just like, that's the reason I just... Yeah. Those are the really good emails. I don't know, that's just why... It... The shitty ones are the people who are just like, I like you. <laughs> <laughs> those are also okay. <laughs> nah, they suck. I would... <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> just joking. I would have to say that that's my, that's my, that, like, whatever, if I'm ever having a day where I'm like... Can't go on game rooms, which doesn't usually happen. But if it does, then I'm just like, yeah, just gotta remember those those guys, those guys who need me. They don't need you. They just they need, need me. You. They may not know it. <laughs> well, they're the ones who say they need us. So I don't yeah. know. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm just I'm, I'm being like half joke. Yeah, those are the best ones. Those are the best. Where do you go? Uh, you have to go up here and then go down the stairs and there's a crank. Hit him with your hookshot. Why do you just walk past him? Because I don't want to kill him. He splits into two and then he's even harder to kill. That's not true. Because there's two. Well, there might be a okay. heart over there. I've never, I haven't made this request in a long time. What? Can somebody remix that? Because that rhymed like a beautiful sonnet. Wait, what was it? Is it, uh, I said... They'll be harder to hit because there'll be two, and then you go. That's not true. It, it was like it was like the, in the manner that we said it, it was perfect. Like it was timed right. perfectly. Maybe you can add another part so that you Check can this this. go. Apart. Whoa! Oh! 
I know everything. Rock and fucking roll. I know everything, including the meaning of life, but I won't tell you and I won't share it because I, I feel... Tell me that ever. I feel you're that the mystery is more... Because I heard it and I was like... Ah. <laughs> you heard it and you're like, that disappointed me and I don't really want... I, it's better to be in the dark. It's like, you know, when you, you know, when you like play a video game or something and you're like got it's like really hard and then you you look up like a thing on a strategy guide or whatever and then you beat it and you're like Ugh. that's like when and then somebody else is playing and they're like this is really hard you're just like don't just don't do it yeah it's like braid or something it's like just fucking play the game no that's like that's like when when you're like mom what is thi this about and she's like i don't want to tell you till you're older but this is the reason and you're just like i could have just kept going <laughs> And I think I just would have been better off. I could have just kept going, not knowing that puppies die. <laughs> puppies die. I don't know, just something like, I'm trying to think of an example. Just like, <laughs> just like, I remember the day I, I don't know if I talked about this on the show. I remember, I remember the day that I learned about Hitler. Really? Yeah, like my cousin, oh, he's not technically my cousin, like a family friend. They're like Jewish or whatever, and, and, uh. He was just telling me about Hitler or something. I was like fucking like seven or some shit. I don't remember how old I was. And he was like, yeah, dude, this guy killed like six million Jews. And I was like, what? Did he have a really big gun clip? Like, <laughs> how did he do that? Six? <laughs> Nobody? Six whole million. How Entire did he, million. How did he get through that many without somebody catching him? <laughs> like, that was my immediate thought. When I heard that some guy named Hitler killed six million Jews. And then it's just like, honestly, well, the day you learn that, you're just like, wait, that can happen? Yeah. And you're just like, you're just done from that day. I, I think that was one of the days I lost my fucking innocence. Learned to fuck you, Hitler. Really? Wow. What do you mean? I, 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 this is interesting. I mean, it's just kind of like a thing you the, learn. The, yeah, the knowledge of Hitler, Hitler is kind of omnipresent. I don't know. I, like, I can't remember the moment where I was like, oh, I, yeah, I, I learned it. about Hitler. I remember for some reason, because it was such a fucking shock. Just like hearing that, like, cause like you're a kid, right? So you're like, some guy actually did that? You're trying to fathom how that could happen in your existence? Yeah, you know, that, it's interesting you say that because I actually did sort of have that revelation like recently. What do you mean? I was reading, um, ah! Tezuka's uh, letter to Adolf mm -hmm. and- Did Adolf get it? Yeah, eventually. It took a long, it took two mangas to get there. <laughs> But, Wait, really? Yeah. But, um, well, the, it, it's the, the, it's kind of a pun, because there's three characters in the book named Adolf. Oh. Um, but, uh, I, I was just reading it, and it was like, it was like, you know, I, I didn't really look that far into World War II ever in my life. Yeah. Or the Third Reich, specifically. You know, no, you can't really see too far without a telescope. Yeah. No, you're right. Go on, that is blow. things all blow up. Are they machinery? It's just satisfying. Go on, then. Um... So yeah, I was reading that, and I was like... I was just like... W when they were humanizing Hitler a little bit, mm -hmm. I was like... He killed... It was like a revelation, <laughs> I was like, murdered... Like, six million Jews. Not single-handedly. But by his hand. I suppose. Like, that was... It's kind of everybody's fault in that whole regime. Well, it was him that was that came out and he wrote Mein Kampf and all that shit. Did he ever specifically state? Was he ever like, I'm gonna kill everybody? Did he ever say that? Yeah. When did he say that? I'm just curious. It was, I mean, it was, like, it wasn't like a, because it's weird. That's that's the revelation you have is like, wait, how did that happen? How did all these people go, how did that? Like, yeah. it, it was a gradual process, but it was. Well, they wanted to regain their <laughs> former glory. Yeah, well, because they were fresh off of World War One, and yeah. and the Jews were already kind of in bad light because they they refused to fight or whatever, and uh, uh, history. So he he wrote Mein Kampf that was kind of like, it's because they are genetically inferior. He actually wrote that shit. Yeah, I gotta read that. I always wanted to read Mein. Kampf. <laughs> I mean, it's like it's fucking the words of Hitler. Yeah, it's, it's like it's like I'm reading. Like, isn't that you know what's cool about books? You What's can that? experience someone's mind. Yeah, absolutely. From years. Yeah, especially like a book that was written in like 1906. Yeah, or I mean even like like I'm talking about like ancient books. Like some oh, guy yeah, that like, lived at like fucking 60 AD. <laughs> you just read his fucking book and you're like, whoa, I'm in his brain! 
It's weird. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Yeah, mine's comp specifically. Mine's comp And it's really, it's like... You have a copy of that line, Rob? Uh, yeah, I've got a couple. I'm serious. Do you, do you have a mine comp? I have some for to let people borrow. What, Rob's looking up on Google Docs and Google Books. Everything yeah. on Google yeah. Docs. Who the fuck would want to pay for that shit? <laughs> like, what? that's like that one book where you're like, I feel okay pirating that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, wait a second! Wait a second! Who makes money on Minecraft? <laughs> Like, who owns the rights to mine cum? I don't know, that's a good question. <laughs> is, it, is it public domain? I think it might it be. It might be, but somebody publishes it. And you can buy it at a book- Why oh, so is somebody makes money off mine fucking cum? <laughs> I hope it's like one of his sons. Did Hitler have kids? I... Oh, I don't know. I don't want to say anything. I don't think so. I seriously don't know. He had like a mistress. I think he had kids. I have no idea. Hitler Jr. Who knew? John Hitler. Because <laughs> that's- nobody says Adolf, because Adolf's a real fucking name. Why was her name Ava Braun? What, his mistress? That's not his, his wife. Wait, who, Ava Braun. Yeah. Uh, I don't know. Because her name was Ava Braun? Did you ever think of that? <laughs> Get out of my life. Next time on Game Grumps, we're gonna talk less about Hitler. More about fun things like sc scuba diving and popsicles. Ooh, piece of heart! Why do you think I enjoy scuba diving? You can... Why would you assume that I would think that's fun? You don't even like it! You're gonna get mad at me over fucking scuba diving? Fuck you! This is... What the fuck, dude? Dude, fuck you. Dude, what the fuck, dude? Scuba diving is something that you can do with your dad. Also, go to the park? You got... you got... Uh, also, read a book. Some about your dad. Minecraft! Best seller in New York City! Best seller in New York City. New York Times!